Okay, everybody. How are we all doing? Big patch today. Really big patch today. Okay, we'll look at stats. I, I don't know if we're even gonna get into playing today. It depends on how the testing goes um, and how fast it goes. Yeah, session start looks like it's back, unfortunately. Okay. Um, well, let's get the shit we need to test. We need a raid bag. Pull up the old ballistics page. Okay, we got that up. We'll get our that up. Okay. Um All right, so the things we are going to test today. We need to test blunt throughput put on plates. Um I also want to get this barter done. Oh, wow. All right, well, we're going to do this real quick, chat. Because... I've legit been trying to get this for three days and I keep missing the reset. They got rid of the Pinewood Roof Vault exploit? Good. Hate doing this to get the rare barters. Yeah, I'm gonna mute my game actually now too because I'm tired of that sound. much more time on fucking Jaeger here. This should have reset by now. What am I missing? You're fucking kidding me, right? those to craft that fucking ammo case I think <sighs> make sure we got extras just in case oh that's so dumb <laughs> oh well alright um 
So the armors we're going to want to test. Let's see. We got class five. Is that a full class steel? Class six steel. Are they 47 normally? frames less on streets and yeah, we'll play around with that a little bit i wonder if there's just some settings that need to be tweaked you know what i mean class six class six uh we'll bring the class five um, what else do we need to bring um we need to bring something with class two aramid And something with class three aramid that's full. No damage. Og is horrible now? Wait, what? They changed the Og too? They ruined recoil on everything. Shot Falato at four out four X. any good I need that okay um we need the pistol. What do we bring? We bring a Glock, wrong trader. Which Glock do we bring? We're gonna make it. And then it becomes the testing Glock forever. Oh, I was like, where are all my parts? Okay.
Ooh, there's fancy sites for this. Oh, there are. It's not what I want though. I want the round, better sight picture. Can I even buy all the parts? Hopefully, yep. fucking euros galore. Okay. We also need an M4 for really good um testing on the old M855A1 and stuff like, or 855, stuff like that. Because 855, is that the 40 pin or 31 pin, right? 556855 five, five, is 31 pin, it is perfect. I don't have any 855, interesting. craft anyways all right so that gets us 30 pen we want to clock chest 41 against class 5 any but i think we can just we'll just bring some 855a1 in i'm not gonna get that nat's ass with it i don't think and then we want to bring some high-end stuff in to see if it completely just blows through um testing done too how do we test is there anything that only covers face but doesn't cover eyes we have this goofy thing the problem is, is you can't see the face I want to be able I want to test the face hit boxes No. Damn it, that took that out of my damn. Had that thing buried in here. Streamer items. Okay, um. Oh, they're all flipped up now. Ah. This covers jaws and ears, right? You know? What is beeping at me? Leave me alone.
full one, right? Yep. Put rip in here. And then what else? Probably green tracer. Okay, rips in the pistol. Put that there. Um, all right, who wants to come along? I need people to bring different armors, to be honest with you. Rigs and things like that. Just because I don't have room for it. bring that in. I think that'll work for what we want to test. All right, I'm going to get in here and I got to get my lunch real quick. So you folks get into lobby who who can come help me. Um, I, I'll probably just need like two bodies uh, and we'll be right back at it. So, who's coming with? Anybody come, gonna be able to come with? So to get into this lobby, you have to do the same thing I just did.
you don't see me in the game you won't because i'm in a group because people don't know what's better streak Which one of you got which who make sure you, you can put your name in here so I know who's who for now and see if it works hopefully the testing goes quick and we don't have to sort through a bunch of bullshit armors we're not testing down to the nat's ass we're just verifying principles i want to make sure that um the blunt damage through plates carries through maybe we test a little bit on different ends to see you know if different armors have different amounts to get into my discord so you can share your screen it would be most most helpful yeah we're going to test the eyes and ears to see if they just like made them smaller or what they did I know about the FPS issues? Not yet. I mean, I've seen people bitching about them, but... Suppose any of you guys are gonna be able to get into Discord so you can share your screen, are you? What Discord channel do you want to send? Uh, should be on deck. You should be able to see on deck. I hope. Um, if not, just join one and let me know who you are, and I can drag you up. Um, so the first thing we're gonna test is Naked Man. Naked man, put on the H or Let's throw those plates out and put a class four in there, shall we? Okay, put on that. A 
Against the Connex, if you would, please. Against the Connex, if you would, please. I'm in the FT group chat Discord. Yeah, I'll drag you up in a sec. All right, look up a bit. So the goal here, you're going to tell me how much damage is done to you. So we're shooting 855 at a class 4 plate with no aramid. Oh, that was two shots. Shit. Whoops, that was two shots. Heal up again. I gotta heal. I gotta... We gotta start over. Hoping you have heals. Alright, you're full health? Yep, good go. Alright, how much damage did we do? You did 12 to my chest, my thorax. Okay, let's shoot like three or four times and make sure it's 12 every time or somewhere around there about or see if there's a big variation. So go ahead and heal up. You're good to go. Yep, same amount. Okay. I'm do a couple more just to be sure. more uh did it get through the plate it um I, the plate's 25 out of 40 yeah i probably got through the plate then it, it did 36 um gre there's a Go ahead and swap, um, pick up this bag, backpack here, and then swap out the, uh, put the class six plate in there. Throw the bag off. You don't have the armor on either. <laughs> All right, we're looking for 12 damage. You got six plates in there? I got six in the front. Did you want them in the back too? No, or? just the front. Okay. That's uh, four. It only did four damage to you? Yes, sir. Go ahead and heal. Good. Four again. Go ahead and heal. We'll keep this... We'll do this, like, see if we get five out of five on four damage here. How much is it doing to the plate? It's 47 out of 55 right now. So it's actually doing quite a bit of damage to the plate. What the fuck? Four again. Same. 
when you guys put that uh, slick on with uh, the class six in the front, please. That one did five. Yeah, that's a rounding thing. Is the uh, armor? Is the, uh, the plate in the front of that? Verify that real quick. Make sure it's in the front. Yes, it is. All right, let's Front. go. On the wall, we'll shoot it and see what happens. <laughs> Look up a little. No damage. Wait, what? I didn't get any damage. Like the plate is, took two points or took four points of damage on the plate. What about the aramid? Pristine. 50 out of 50. Huh. Play down to 43 out of 50. Still no airman damage. And no damage to you? Uh, one thorax. Don't heal. I'm going to... Uh... I'm going to shoot you and just we'll see how much it does. One more thorax damage. Plates down to 39. Still no aramid. So you're down two health on your thorax right now? Yes. Uh, no change on health. Aramid er, is still fine. Plate is down to 36. So it's doing like... 0.5 or 0.6 damage per shot then? That's 0. interesting. 0.5, 0.6 probably. Because I'm still at 83 out of... Or 85. Oop. One more point for health. Down to 82. Plates down to 32, still no damage to Aramid. No damage to Aramid, plates to 28. Health is still 82 for Thorax. Alright, uh, you put on the. Do you have a class 4 plate sitting somewhere? That's a five. I didn't bring enough class four plates. Son of a bitch. I want to see if plate level impacts uh, how much damage is done. Um, is there any four plates in any of this stuff? Plus six. That's not gonna have any. All right, screw it. We'll just go with the. Uh, we'll go with class five. Um, in that slick, wherever it's at, put uh, this TC Guardian class five combined materials plate in there. You have to take it off to put it on. You can't wear it. No, the slick's not a good armor, guys. It's just an easy one to test. It's the only reason I have it. Make sure we got rip ammo in here. We do. We're still rocking 855. Throw the uh, rig off, if you would, please. Okay, so, uh, kind of looking for the same thing just to see how much damage it does to your thorax. Ah. 
What do we do to your chest there? Yeah, I, sh I know we're shooting it, but it's, it's just the, it's the Aramid thing. We're going to test it more. It's not this specific armor, chat. It's the machines. How much, uh, how much did we do to your chest? Can, uh, you got Voight, big guy? Can you hear me? Yeah, I guess you can hear me. I, are you talking? Can't hear you. Uh, throw the armor out and let somebody else test it. That can, I can actually hear. All right, your full health. Uh, I'm still at the 82. Heal, heal up then. I've got to bring an knife. Just propotol. Pro uh, can you hear me now? I can hear you now. I had my mic muted, fucking like an idiot. <laughs> All right. Well, unfortunately, the propotol is not going to work because we won't be able to see progression yeah. of damage. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think about All that. Right. I forgot right. to bring a knife. <laughs> anyway, I'm saying I had one, and I, the play was at 5.23. All right, so it did I, one damage to you, shot. and you haven't you haven't healed? Either. No. All right, look up. We'll shoot again. See if it's like zero damage. Ah! One damage. And the plate is at 49.7. So you've got 83 health right now on your thorax? Yes. 82. 81. All right, so plate level does matter. 4.4. So plate level does matter. Okay. Um, so we need to zero an arm, a chess piece here. So... Uh, somebody put on this Thor. Should I heal now or what? Uh, yeah, heal because we're gonna sh we're gonna zero the Thor out is the goal here. We're gonna zero the Thor and then put a plate in it and see what happens. So you'll have to heal after each of these. Okay. Ah. I'm assuming it's only doing damage to the front aramid. Um, yeah, but I can. Let me know when it's zeroed. It's at 17 right now. Ah. Go again. Eleven point eight. What I want to see is if the zeroed aramid Six. still does a uh, any kind of impact on it. You know what I mean, chat? One. Hold on. Let me heal real quick. Yep. All right, go ahead and throw a class six plate in it. There should be another one. Yeah, there's a K steel here in the bottom of the, the, this. Okay. All right, class six played in, zeroed chest, right? Zeroed aramid, sorry. Yep, zeroed aramid, all full health. Let's do this. Ah. 55 damage. 34 to the plate, left on the plate. Oh, shit, I shot SSAIP at you. <laughs> 
Okay. I'll go swap the plane. I was no no, you're good. You're good. Leave it for now. It'll it'll still work. Okay. I'm good to go. Thirty-one left on the plate. How much to do to you? Two. Okay, heal and er don't heal. We're gonna check that again. Two again. Okay, one more. Twenty-seven point. Two, two, three two, two. So it did three that time. Okay, so it is reducing by quite a bit, actually. And zero to Aramid stops providing the protection. Okay. Um, so we did plates alone, Aramid alone. Uh, let's test the I hit box. Put on the uh, the airframe and put on the airframe and the glasses right here. Okay. Look up just a little bit. So what we're going to be looking for here is an impact on your uh on your eyes, okay? Yes, sir. Ah! Yeah, I took head damage there for sure. I got Well, it. yeah, but did it do damage to the glasses? Copy. Let me check. Uh, negative. Okay, let's try this. Go ahead and heal. Ah. Damage to the glasses? Nope. I'm gonna need to do a last tax or something in a second. Good to go. Damage to the glasses? Negative. Heal. How much damage is each shot doing to you, roughly? One. Uh, to me, it's doing one damage, and it's doing one to the, the face mask as well. All right. Well, let me know when we hit the glasses, finally. Oh, okay. Nope. Go ahead. Again. Um, let me heal up and then we'll go again. It's just, that was two that time. So. Yeah. Again. Again. Go ahead. Nope. Still nothing? Nope, negative. All right, tell me if this does damage to the face shield or the helmet. Was that to the helmet or face shield? Face shield. Helmet or face shield? Top helmet hitbox. Ah! Same top helmet. All right. Ah! 
Now we're gonna try to hit the uh, glasses. All right, still top helmet. That one is face mask. I got 18 head health left. You got anything to heal with? No. Nope. Anybody got a heal they can throw him? I completely spaced on bringing heals. Yeah, I did too. I always do. I brought an LSHZ if you need to try that out. Ah, eh, we'll just go with the. Uh, I'm not dead yet. You got a propotol? Yeah, I do. Hit that. We'll go with that for now. Let me know when you're full health. Down the space shield. Are we getting to the glasses yet? Negative. Nope. No glasses. You full health? Yes, sir. Okay, look up a little bit. Face shield again, no glasses. What's the face shield at? 12. 10, no glasses. We've put 15 shots into this guy's face. I think it finally got through. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, let me know uh, if you died to uh, head eyes on that. <laughs> oh, that wasn't me. I know. I know. I'm guy. talking to the stream because he can't hear me anymore. Okay. Uh, shit. Um, I'm not 100% sure how to test fucking the eye hitbox reliably. It was head eyes. Okay. Oh. I'm gonna try this L LSHC with the uh, skull mask. See what happens to it. Hmm. <laughs> uh, put the bear frame on him. That was on him. I'm gonna test the. I want to test the ears. Oh, we're out of time. <laughs> Neo Steel Mandible. Does that cover face and not eyes? Because the problem is, the, the big thing is I want to be able to see the face and see where the actual hitbox is. I mean, we were only shooting green tracer at it, so. You want me to bring fast MT? Well, I had one in my bag. I'm just trying. I'm thinking we're going to test ears, but I'm uh, next. But I'm going to try to figure out uh, what um, how to figure out how we test between eyes and uh, face hitbox. Because I because I, I want to see if they shrunk the eye hitbox. That's what I'm trying to figure out right now. Yeah. Heels, I'm bringing in the 
bag. But you have to be able to see it. the thing is you have to be able to see the face to be able to do that. So the masks that like completely cover you don't allow you to do that. Hmm. Okay. Um what do I need? I should bring in another class four plate, huh? Let's see where are they at? Okay, all good there. We're gonna test ears next, primarily. Make sure you guys bring heels this time. I, I, I'm bringing two grizzlies and three Apex <laughs> just in case. Yeah. Um, a bring a Zagustin as well. Bring Zagustins and a water if you can as well. Um, like one of those little emergency water packets that you because the Zagustin will dehydrate you, but it'll keep you from bleeding. Yep. Put, uh... I don't want to be eating mayonnaise. See that aramid was if you know. doing, taking nothing. Nikita just posted a Reddit that people will not be able to buy a clue through M microtransaction with what's one? Huh? Yeah, the ears are easy to test. Ears are really easy to test. What's up? I got a couple of things for hydration. That works. You still coming, Blue Warrior? It's supposed to be funny. It failed. You can't be funny on Reddit. What are you talking about? Reddit is the most serious thing on the planet. Wait, are you talking about this? He posted this a while ago. We talked about this in the video that Abel is actually working on right now. If you can't come, Blue, that's cool. Just let me know, bud, so I can boot you and we can get going here. He's AFK. So we'll roll with you two for now. We got two guys is more than enough, man. We can get probably even get by with one. Two is nice in case we kill somebody on accident. We can still test. Swap to single fire. Yeah. <laughs> against grenades i don't believe so i got a couple of grenades we could try <laughs> yeah, it's no real way to test it man because you don't know it's so hard to, they're, they're, we would need a lot of people to test it properly
So you can buy 20 extra lines on top of EOD now? No, not yet. But in the near future is what BSG has said about that. Well, there's a fa there's three boundaries there, Jarmac. You have eyes, you have face, and you have jaw. And I'm trying to see if they shrunk the eye hitbox. shrunk it i have no idea it's not like the face or the jaw is less deadly unless there was maybe a bug strip him down strip him down all right helmet uh, with ears, glasses, and a mask, I want your face covered up as much as possible so we don't kill you on accident. And uh, put on like the Gen 4 or the, the, re the fort so that your neck's covered. You're that or the fucking the Zabralo right here? That doesn't have ear protection. The Cayman doesn't have ear protection, so either put on the... Uh, the uh wendy or the airframe airframe sounds like the best bet probably yeah yeah and then the skull mask the death shadow and then glasses grab airframe yeah the oh, shadow yes. glasses and then put on the gen 4 or the zabralo whichever and uh we will test. Can you drop stems to each other? Uh, yeah, most of the time. All right. Got a Zagustin or whatever in propotol if we need it. Look up a little. Um, shit. Uh, put on the Wendy instead of that helmet. Okay. I can't see your ear. All I can see. I'll be able to at least see your ears in the Wendy. I think. It is inside right here. It's kind of inside the Osprey armor a little bit. Glitched in it. Okay. Look up a smidge. You got ear protection on. So we're looking for an ear hit. Like a hit on your ear armor. Yep. Make sure we got rip ammo in this. Yo, those were hits before. Those used to be hits. Nothing's happening. They, hits from my <laughs> they it, a bitch, you know. Throw off your Balakov. Uh, never mind. You, I don't want to kill you. No, no, you're good. You're good. Put that back on. Uh, throw off the skull mask, though. That is not. Those used Nothing. to be hits right there. So they shrunk, Nothing. they made the ear hitbox smaller. Oh, I see what you're oh, that hit. Where'd we uh, hit? Three to the head and. Which piece of armor? Hit the ears. Okay, we did One hit the ears. To the ears. Okay, heal up. We're gonna try again. And got some tinnitus going on now. Nothing. Those used to be hits. That's so good. Mm. That oh, should that be your ear. That was ear, yes. Uh, three damage to head. Yeah, go ahead and heal. And then turn to your uh, right. All right, let me know if this hits the ear or the helmet. That hit... 
it nape. hit. If it did, it hit the nape. It hit nape. One point. Okay. And four to head. Yeah, keep healing. Four damage to my head. We're just, I'm just going to walk it in. I'm just going to walk it in until we get a hit on your ear plate so we kind of know what they did just here. trying to fight a cat off my mouth. <laughs> Uh, four to head, and that was Nape again. One damage to the uh, helmet. Okay. Go ahead and put the uh, skull thing back on just in case. Because I'm going to get far forward and accidentally kill you if we're not careful here. That was Nape again. Helmet's down to 24 to 27 yep. and 4 health. Still Nape. Good. So the ear hitbox is smaller now. Mm. In multiple directions because we were hitting ear here before. That should be a good ear hit. 3 damage and yeah, 1 Nape. Oh, that hit Nape? Oh. Uh, Should have hit ear. No, okay, ear is yeah, yeah. down to 27. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay, go ahead and 180 so we can get rid of these decals a little bit. Shoot the other side. Oh, they're over here too. That's handy. All right, let me know if this hits. This should hit the. Ooh, I'm not sure what this is going to hit. Uh, that. Messed up the glasses, but it did. It looks like it did ear. It's 27 out of 30 now. And two damage to head. Okay, so it hit the ears. And the glass is now cracked. The, oh, it hit the. It, wait, what? It cracked your visor? Yes, the glass. In the upper right hand corner, the glass is cracked now. But it did damage to the ear hitbox, or the ear armor. Yes. But none to the visor, but it's cracked. Try that again. That time... Year, it's at 27 out of 30. And one damage to head. Does that hit the helmet? Yeah, it looks like it hit the helmet. And okay. I only took one point of damage for it. See what this does? Another crack to the face shield. Any damage to the face shield? No, no damage to anything. Can you share your screen on and, Discord real quick? <laughs> uh, yeah. No damage to anything. What do you mean no damage to anything? We had to damage. Something. I mean, as in, uh, the the mask. The mask is down to twenty seven out of twenty nine. It hit the, and the mask. Glasses are. It hit the mask, and the glasses have taken a point of damage so far. But the face the shield face... has no damage. But it's cracked. <laughs> Share your screen no so damage. we can see this. No damage on the shield, but the shield is still cracked. Sharing? No, it's not let me share. Go live. Yeah, it's stopping me from sharing screen. Uh, hang on a sec. All right, now try and share your screen. There we go. Oh. Yeah, it's cracked. Okay, your face shield's cracked. No now go look at the helmet. No damage, damage to the helmet. Three damage to the ears. Damage to the, the death shadow and the glasses. All right, keep that up. Keep that screen up right there with all those things. And don't move. Okay, so... Here's what we have. Oh gosh, I screwed that up. Here's what we have. We have, he is 439 health. We are 
26.7. Nothing on the that and 24 on the glasses. We're going to shoot that same exact spot. I think it was right here, right? Point three damage to the face shield. Wait, what? Yeah, so it's down to twenty six point seven. Oh, that, that, yeah, 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 but nothing to the. All right, um, hang on a sec. Uh, don't move. <laughs> Wait, what? No damage to anything. No, go, pull your glasses out. Pull your pull, pull the glasses out. The glasses have damage to them. Watch, we're gonna do oh, one We're gonna do damage to the glasses. Watch. One point. <laughs> Twenty-three. The, the orders, the orders out. Everything's out of order. Chat. They have the layering backwards, <sighs> so the glasses are outside of the. Oh. Uh, what? And I got a concussion. Wow, the face shield is really cracked, but it has no damage points taken. Yeah, it's damaging the face shield, but it's or it's not damaging the face shield, but it's cracking it. This is this is funny. <laughs> 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 All right, so here here's uh, how do we do this? Um, so the glasses are in front of the mask, which is in front of. All right, all right I'm gonna shoot you in the mask now. Okay. Did that do anything to the glass of the face shield? It did that time, right? It did to the uh, the face shield. No, it didn't. Uh, All right, so it doesn't no matter damage. the hitbox. It's fucking. Uh, and two points of hit. All right, hit damage put the, uh, to the head. Put, put the airframe on. Let's see if the airframe does the same thing. Make sure it's not just a helmet issue. Yeah, that is. That's. <laughs> I can see again. Okay, look towards me because we're going to shoot you in the face. Look towards me. All right, it should be in the jaws, so... Make sure we don't kill him on accident here. Okay, rip ammo. Okay. That is damage to the shield. Not to the chops. Oh, and not to your and skull thingy. Right? Did it do any damage to your skull thingy? Because you were, no, you were 24.7, I think, right? Yeah, 24.7. And no damage to head. Okay, throw the chops off real quick. Uh, one damage to the shield. Face one shield. damage to head. Okay, Last so that ordering is... Well, let's see if the eyes are f screwed up first. Face shield? Uh, yeah, so it's, it's just not, that so it's that face shield specifically that the order is bugged somehow? No. I don't know yeah. how. Flip the face shield, flip the face shield up and heal your head. Give me a thank you for the five months. All right, look at your uh, uh, um, glasses. Let's see what the damage on your glasses and mask are. There we go. So 22 and 24.7. Glasses. It, it, so the glasses are out in front of the mask. <laughs> yeah, and I took five health. Oh, gosh. Okay, uh, put the chops back on. Put the visor down. Need room to have them in. <sighs> yeah, just grab a backpack. I 
Okay, and... you're fully healed, right? <laughs> yes. All right. Oh, so watch hell. watch your health and let me know when you lose your first point of health. Just took a point. Okay, heal. Took a point. No point. So it's doing less than a point of damage. Throw out off the skull mask. You're full health. I am full health. Ooh, one point ahead damage. Okay. And that's down to 33. Down to 32. One point of health each time. 31, right? This is down to 31, yes. 30? 30. 30, and uh, I'm at 33 still. 29. Now I'm at 32. Oh, health? 29. What's I'm your head health? Very... 32 out of 33. I've okay. 35. All right, so the layering is helping there. Um, mm. Go ahead and put the death shadow back on. Um. Huh. Uh, while we're, I'm going to keep shooting him. Go ahead and put on a, uh, put on a gen, put on the slick with a class five plate. Copy that. All right. Um, let me know where I hit here armor wise. Oh, the chops probably don't differentiate on armor areas, do they? Fuck, I didn't even realize that. I took three hilts from that sh Yeah, it's because there's nothing layered. Okay, go ahead and throw throw the helmet on the ground real quick. Okay, I want you to tell me what hitbox I hit when I shoot you right here. Let's test this real quick. Where are we going to hit here? Miss. Nothing. Yeah, no, I'm testing my Nothing. height. Okay, tell me where, what hitbox I hit when I shoot right here. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's the only way we're going to know. All right, 855A1. Head ears. It was head ears. Okay. Can you look up a bit? Um, make sure we're not on full auto here. So what we're looking for is a when we damage the aramid, okay? And how much we how much health how much damage we do to you. So you're going to be healing until that happens, okay? Yes, sir. So I just propofol. Prop no, I, I'm going to nope. know the damage. No, no, nope, nope. yeah, we need to know the damage. Ah! For uh, thirty nine fucking and. So just watch the aramid and let me know when the aramid actually takes damage, okay? Yes, sir. It took damage, four damage. The aramid took four damage. Yes, sir. How much damage did we do to you? 48. I have 48 uh, torso left. 48 torso. So there was probably one tick of bleed. 85 minus 48, so we did 37 damage. And 32 left on the plate, just so you know. That's 44 pen, 49. So we did 20, we had a 25% damage reduction. 43 left on the aramid, 26, 48 on the thorax again. 48 again? Yep. Ah. 
40 left on the Aramid, 20 on the... 47 uh, damage, and then one damage to my stomach. One damage to your... Yeah, it's probably from the bleed. Okay. All right. Um... Go ahead and put a uh, class six plate in that. Should I throw it in the back so the airman's fresh or not? Nah, nah. Ain't gonna matter that much. How much does SSAIP? It is 57 pen. So theoretically, this could stop it. A lot of people are saying they are, Mercado. All right, let me check. Is there any... Whoopsies. What the hell? Go away. Um, Let me check and see if there's anything else I need to test while we're here. All right, you got a class six plate in? Class six plate? Yes, sir. Full health? Thorax health, yes. Don't face, face, I'm turning to get her under your arm. Stay faced over here. Ah. 56 thorax. So it did full damage, huh? Interesting. Fifty-three damage. So it is doing a little bit of reduction. Okay. It's not catching it though. I was kind of hoping you'd get a catch out of the aramid. What's your aramid at? Twenty-eight, and then the plate is nineteen. Twenty-eight out of. Twenty-eight out of fifty. Okay. Go ahead and put the Zabralo on. It's got class six in it, right? Yes, sir. Seventy-nine out of uh, eighty-five. So your health is seventy-nine. Yeah, and then the aramid is untouched. The aramid is untouched. It's forty-one out of sixty. The aramid is untouched, though. Yep. Go ahead and heal. What I want is a aramid damage, but a stop. Aramid is at 80 out of 85. Thorax is 46. I didn't stop. All right, we're back to 855A1 here. 78 out of 85. 48 out of 85. What's the Aramid at? 78 out of 85. 74 at 85. How much damage we do to you? 42 and I believe. <sighs> the plate is zero. The airman is at 71. Okay. And I have another bleed and I'm at 36. All right. Go ahead and turn it. We'll shoot the back now. See if we can get better numbers out of the back. Uh, I gotta grab with that guy's health kit or something. Oh, it's probably in his butt. Fair point. Here you go. I think his back. Yeah, ba Grizzly in his backpack. Go ahead and pick this backpack up. Okay, let's see if we can get one through that. Because I'm trying to see if the aramid will catch. Go ahead, let me see your back. 
I'm trying to see if the aramid will catch around. Oh, there's a plate in the back. Yeah, yeah no, that's good. That's I want to see after it gets okay. through a plate. All right, 85. Aramid is fine. Plate is 51 out of 60. And 80. Now I'm at 78. Go ahead and heal. Aramid is at 85 still. Go ahead and heal. User. Hold on a second. Hold on. Hold on. I got multiple things going on right now. I only got about 20 seconds here, so. Uh, okay. Well, I'll see, I'll see you in the next one, I guess. <laughs> All right. Go ahead. Go. 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 Uh, Aramid's 85. Aramid is still 85. Aramid, 85. Keep going. It's uh, 85. 85. How do we test this chat? How do we test to see if the Aramid is going to catch a t catch a bullet? I thought class six was going to be the best class six and three Aramid was going to be the best way to do it, but I don't think it is. I think we need to go with a lighter pen ammo um, and a lower end plate. So like 40 pen or 35 pen on a class four plate with three Aramid. Or a class five plate on three Aramid. No, it needs to be like 30 something. <laughs> sort of, Chris, it's still gonna do blunt damage, but what I wanna see here, let me, let me color, let me do, let me open up paint. Paint is the best way to show this stuff, okay? So here's what I'm trying here's what I'm trying to figure out right now, okay? We have our armor plate, right? Oopsies. That was a bad drawing. We have an armor plate, correct? This is our plate. Behind that, we have and I'm just going to do this as a box, okay? We have our our uh, our aramid Okay. And then behind that, we have the the fleshy part, the body. Okay. So what I'm trying to figure out is that when a bullet travels through all of these pieces, okay, let's say when it gets here, it penetrates, we get a pen, but here it stops. Okay. We stop here. Is this scenario happening? And what we need is, for example, this is going to be class three, right? And we'll say this is, uh, we'll say this is class four. Our bullet at, let's say, 35 pen, once it gets to here, it's going to be downrated to, let's say, 25 pen or 20. Pen. We'll say 20 pen. It's going to be downgraded to 20 penetration, which means that this actually gives it a chance to stop it. That's what I'm trying to figure out right now. And in order to do that, this pen has to be low enough that when it does get reduced, it gets stopped. The problem with shooting 58 when it gets reduced, it's still like 30 pen, which it goes right through class three. God, I love paint. What is Aramid? Aramid is the material that all of these armors are. The soft armor. So I think with eight, oh, that's not, we need to be like, it's eight, five, five. We just shoot eight, five, five at class four plates. That's all we do. That's the simplest way to test it, to be honest with you. Absolutely the simplest way to test it. Oh, whoops. Wrong fucking...
You want me to bring in a pure aramid uh, armored rig? No, you're good. I'm kind of past testing that kind of stuff. This is more just so we can show the community what is happening so people actually understand. Um, and there isn't guessing, because there still is. People still are confused by what is happening. And rightfully so, right? It's not like this is easy. This isn't, this isn't simple. Yeah, this is my first white. Figure this stuff out. <laughs> and you're still trying to figure out some of the other shit we've all memorized for three years. I get the basic idea. It's not too hard. I watched a lot of everyone streaming before I actually finally pulled the, the switch and got the game just trying to learn it first learn it doing it and getting down to it Twitch drops were happening. That's when I pulled the trigger and got it. All right, uh, we're gonna try to get through class. So we're gonna, that's what we're trying to do. We want class four plates. <sighs> I forget to bring, no, there it is. Made sure to bring a couple of goose in the time. Put in the bag. Okay, put the Thor on. You got class fours in that, that, uh, Karasa? You got class fours in that Karasa? Go ahead and put the ground on. So that'll be a good test of class two versus class three aramid if you do. Yeah, that fucking... Can you see it? Or sorry, the, the Thor, my bad. Okay. So it's going to take a couple of shots because we're only shooting 31 pen. Um, but... The goal is we're going to look for basically aramid damage, but very little body damage. You ready? Mm. 
Okay. So we're looking at right now a 25 out of 25 Thor, 40, 40, 40 out of 40 class four plate. So we're going to shoot. Looks Three like damage the to the plate aid it. So go ahead and heal. Oof. Seven damage to health. Seven damage. That's three to the plate. Nothing to the air mid yet? Nope. No air mid damage at all. No air mid damage. Three and seven again. Yeah, just keep healing. No air mid damage. Still just play and no damage to thorax that time. No damage to thorax? Wait, did I hit your stun? Mm, nothing. I did no, no damage. Da period. How did we do seven damage before and do fucking zero damage now? I don't know. Okay. That, that did eight damage and the uh, airmen still no damage plates down to 25. No, it wouldn't it'd have damage on his arm. We didn't do any damage to him on that one shot. No arm damage even. Check, open up your armor real quick. Three damage to the armor, no air mid. Seven da or eight damage to thorax. No, I think it's the frag system's fucking broke, chat, is what I think it is. And it's what I've thought for weeks, months now. I keep forgetting we're almost two months into the wipe or a month and a half into the wipe. It's the frag system is broken, is what I think. Still it's no air mid damage. Fucking boogeyman for me. And no damage to you that time, right? Yeah. How much damage did we do to the just... how much damage did we do to the plate? Do you remember? Plates down to nineteen. I think it's what three were again. before. I think it was Yeah, it looks like So we did no damage, damage to you, right? Yeah, no damage. <laughs> uh I took nine damage from that, one damage oh, the Aramid. to the Aramid. Oh there we go, there we go. There we go, chat. It finally worked. And no plate damage. Okay. Or no, it did. It did play damage. Oh. So here's what happened here, chat. Pull up your armor again. Here's what happened. The bullet got through the plate, but the aramid stopped it. The aramid only took one point of damage, and it did, what, 90 you, I think? It did nine damage, I think? Yes. Nine damage. So it's working like it's supposed to. Finally, the plate got penetrated. But the aramid caught the bullet. We're gonna try again. Aramid plates at fourteen. Ten health. Ten health. The aramids to aramids catch, plates the aramids catching it almost every time right now. Oh, it's that was forty one oh, oh, health. Catch, oh, it didn't catch that time. <laughs> we are we are getting damage. your plates yeah but your plates getting jacked up bad so yeah Ooh, 45 health damage yeah we're, we're pretty much punching Airman. through now all right we're gonna try yeah. the, we're gonna try on the carasa now plates pretty much gone seven all right so uh you're not sharing your stream which is fine but um you are you've got a class four plate in here Four class polymer plate in there. Nothing in the back. Full health. Okay. What we're looking for is when the aramid takes damage and how much damage it does to you as a character. Okay. So aramid damage to me. Yep. Yep. Copy that. <laughs> Nothing here. Uh, that's right. I got 78. Yeah. Go ahead and heal between shots. And the only time I don't want you to heal is when the aramid takes damage. 
Copy that. If you want to go through another, uh, go through a class five plate in. We'll test a little bit hotter ammo. Uh, 54 damage to mid. And I got 51 health left. What's the damage to the aramid? One. And it did, and you got 55 damage? Or 55 health? I had 54 thorax left. So it did 31. Which is a reduction of 30%, give or take. I'm going to do the math exactly. All right. Try again. Nothing to air mid. Okay, go ahead, Neil. Uh, 78 left. Yeah, that's the plate stopping it. Which tier 5 do you want me to put in Doesn't this? matter. Put in the tall car. 52 left on air mid. 50 left on me. It's 50 or... That's 50, okay. So it's doing one damage to the airman or more? Uh, it did two, I believe. Okay. Ah! Nothing to air mid. 77, uh, yep. damn, 77 health points to thorax. Up to 28 additional lines. Yep, up to, up to 280 spaces of stash. Uh, nothing to far, uh, nothing to air mid. 77 again. What's the plate at? 22 out of 40. Uh, 51 on air mid, so one damage, and 47 left on the right. So we're not catching any of the rounds. So it, it, guys, this is this is what I wanted to show you the difference between class two and three is. This is a very specific case, a class four and a class three, uh, a class four plate and class two versus class three aramid. But you saw how we were stopping rounds with a class three aramid and we're not doing it here. No, I'm not nearly as much. So 50 left on the aramid, so damage. 46 uh, health points from the thorax left. The Aramid is reducing the damage a little bit, it looks like, but it's not doing much. Forty-eight on the Aramid, fifty forty-five on the Thorax, so it's even reducing the amount of damage that the, the Aramid. Yeah, is there's a little bit of roll there too. Um, all right, we're gonna try the class five now if you're ready. Uh, go ahead and put something new on Aramid-wise. Class three. Okay. Class three. Has class five in all. Oh. All right, we got. Oh, that's SSAP. We don't want that. We want eight five five eight one. Eight five five eight one. Okay. Well, it's the, everyone should run the best armor they can, right? But you always can't. All right, so you've got a class five plate in? Yep, it's all class fives. And class three aramid? Yep. So we're 60, um, and we're 52. Eight. Go ahead and heal. And yeah, we're just looking for that health. one where we finally get the Aramid. No Aramid. Aramid, three. Okay, how much do we do to you? The bullet got all the way through that time, though. Yeah. Okay, so go ahead and heal. Yeah. I mean, it's a dice roll. There's a chance it can do it, and there's a chance it can't. Where we're at right now, we're at probably roughly a... Six, we're over 50% chance that we're going to get through on most of these shots, so... 24 oh. damage. Wait. We did, did we do three air? Were we at 49 on the air mid before? Mm, I thought we were chat. Were we at 49 or were we 50 on the aramid before? 
Somebody go back and look real quick. Plates down 30. It was 49? Okay. All right, heal up. Mm. So the, basically the, the plate stopped that one is what happened. Yeah. Two air mid. Plates down to 22. 39. Helps. Go ahead and... S you got a Zagustin, go ahead and pop that. No, it wasn't 52. We did that. We got a penetration before that shot. Okay, so we are 40. Hover over your airman again real quick. 47. Um, okay. I'm going to try and shoot a little bit lower and still hit the plate, but hit your stomach hit box. Can you look up just a little bit? All right, this should be your stomach hit box, but should still hit the plate. Oh, plate's down to 15. That's fine. So the yeah. stomach. Oh, go, 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 go back to the, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. Did we get it? Where's stomach? Or did it hit the chest? Damn, it hit the chest. <laughs> okay, I see what happens now. Uh, never mind. I see what's going on. Okay. You heal up. Four damage to the plate stem to seven. Health. Oh my god. And went through and got the stomach that time. Yeah. Forty eight damage to stomach. Okay. Uh go ahead and swap plates real quick. Let's get a fresh plate in there. What do you got in here? Um, I got the the polymer four level four plate and then a fresh door. I don't even know what to test against that, to be honest with you. Because we're jumping, because we're something? basically jumping 10 pen. I need to bring something that's in, I need to bring like BT in that's like 37 pen to test against it to see what happens there. Because um, you need to drop the pen down. I don't know what the math is, but you need to basically drop the penetration down to... To have consistently the aramid class three to stop it it's got to be below like 25 pen so that means we can't be any over what 35 i mean 31 pen can go class through class four hacked so 31 pen has like a 15 percent 10 to 15 percent chance to go through class four and 41 pen and 50 or class 5 51 pen class 6 right the closer basically when you get to 40 pen you've got like a 90 percent chance or something i can't remember what the numbers are um where the fuck's my phone i need battle buddy where is my phone oh there it is um veritas's battle buddy kind of still works i'll look here real quick What's 40? What's 40 pen? What's something that's 40 pen? Like right on the nose, 40 pen. Is there anything? Oh, there we go. FMJSX. Okay. Should have known that. I was looking for that before. FMJSX penetration chance on class four armor is 87% roughly, give or take. So round up to 90%, right? Okay, you ready with that class five? We'll give her another whirl. Yep. Forty-eight 
43 out of 52. Six damage to play. Go ahead and heal. Health is 11 health hit. Yeah, I, we'll just heal until we see the Aramid take damage. That's all I care about. Okay. Took and, and you took. All right. So we're not. It's not reducing the damage enough to matter. Can you throw a class six plate in there real quick? Uh, there should be some in my my uh, backpack, my raid bag. Because I'm wondering if there's a difference between class five and class six. Like the class six plate will reduce the pen more and we'll get a stop, whereas the class five wasn't. Uh, put these it in your put it put, put it in your back too, and we'll shoot the fresh air on your back. These are these are class four plates in here. There should be a class six in one of the armors though. Yeah, there's a class six. The prayer, this mono the monoclete P. Oh no, that is a class four. I can't read. Uh, the slick has a class six in it probably. Yeah, grab the out of the slick. Just take the ones out of the slick. Does the angle of the player affect anything at all? Um, I don't believe so. Well, I mean. Yes, Will. There is a variable in there that angle can impact, but it doesn't have to do with the armor. It has to do with what hitbox you're hitting. So let me show you an example here. Um, go ahead and can you cr turn around and crouch down real quick and throw your armor off? So if I'm shooting at an extreme... I'm sorry. Whatever I did, I'm sorry. Oh, I ain't gonna kill you. I'm just showing chat something. Shooting at an extreme angle like this, hitting here or here, is two different hitboxes. And if I'm... Can okay, put the armor back on? Now, for argument's sake, let's say at this extreme angle, let's say this doesn't have stomach protection, right? And the stomach hitbox stops right where my laser... You see my laser is? The stomach hitbox is, is from here on down. This is all stomach, right? So if I'm shooting at a fucking crazy angle at him like this... Even though I'm hitting the armor, visually, I'm passing through it. I'm hitting the stomach hitbox so it doesn't check for the armor. So that's how angle matters, Will. But as far as deflection, that only matters on helmets. You good? Yes, I got tier six plates. As far as angle and bullets, it only matters on helmets and face stuff. Uh, you got it in the back? Yes. They fixed what in patch notes? Uh, turn around then, so I can shoot you in the back. <laughs> okay, we got 50 back, and the plate is 50 out of 50 class 6. Let's see if we can get... Uh... Okay. 8 to the plate, 3 to the character. Ricochets are angle dependent. That's part of the calculation of the variable. The higher the angle, the higher the chance. Wait, down to 34, so another Four eight. Down. Four to character. You go ahead and heal. What I'm looking for is an Aramid stop with this class six plate, hopefully. Still no Aramid hit. Plate's doing its job. Mm -hmm. No, they didn't. It's not. That's not something they can fix, Jess. That's the problem, and that's not any, nothing. In the patch notes talked about that. Hermit's Delta, or no, Med. character. Yeah, the classics plate's gonna hold up a lot better. Mm. Oh, two to Aramid. And it got, but it got help. through. Go ahead and heal. We'll see if we can get a couple of these in. Yeah, Supposedly, Druzy. The data miners say that this stuff is still there. Even though the game doesn't show it. But there Hermit's was only... down to 44. Plates at 2. Yeah, we're... We're punching 60, clean through. 64 to health. Grab another AFAC. Alright. Um, so... 
turn and face the side sideways so watch this chat um you see how the armor i'm shooting through the armor right now you see that i'm physically shooting through the actual armor model but i'm not hitting him until i hit him the game doesn't check for armor that's how the system works you want me to swap the plates around? It the used to, Viper. Down to two. Nah, we're down to three minutes here. Um, I think we... Uh, let me think here. I don't know if there's anything else to... I don't, I, I'm not really sure there's anything else to test. The fifth what happens bullet the mark, Hesley says they fixed it. I'm just trying to, trying to inform relay info. Well, let me go look and see what that specifically was real quick. Um, what the fuck are the patch Jesus. notes at? A little bit of damage over all my legs and arms. Reduce the possibility for bolts to pierce through a character's thorax and stomach. That's something completely different. This is talking about something different, Jess. Right now, for example, your arms can be penetrated through. And I guess we can test this. This is something else we can test next. Um, all right, the next thing, we're gonna do a quick test on penetration. Uh, basically just really high pen ammo on you guys back standing in front of each other to see if anything happens. Yeah, I'm surprised they didn't plate. update the Corund at all. Wonder what'll happen when the plate is zeroed. What do you mean? Oh, the plate's at two out of fifty right now. I mean, it just—it's like any other armor when they zero. Hmm. What do I put my in-game volume to? Um, I don't know what I'm at, Ethan. It's probably like ninety percent or seventy percent or something. But I have like three different places my volume adjusts at depending on like the stream there's a stream volume there's a volume i hear there's an output volume from the game there's a volume for the recording it, there's it's all over the place depending on all right so let's throw in some 993 because i think that's the oh wait do i have bs that's the highest pen stuff i have i believe yep there we go uh bs <gasps> oh you know what there's another really good way to test this too Wait, we'll just take it off. We might bring in another... If anybody else wants to come in, we might bring in another body just to test this piercing body thingy. Pesley's video at the two minute mark if you want to hear him say it. Uh, yeah, I might hear it. We'll pull it. I guess we'll pull it up. Um, here, Jess. Ah, I can't, Jess, because if I pull it up on YouTube, I get fucking. There's a copyright thing that potentially happens. Maybe. We'll see. Yeah, if anybody else can join, hop in here real quick because we need multiple people. I want to see if the bull... If they're saying that you can't penetrate thorax anymore. Hi, guys. This is... Hi, guys. This is Pestily. Remove the possibility for bullets to pierce through a character's thorax and stomach. So the idea behind that is if you were shooting from an angle, you'd be able to go through someone's... Ch uh, thorax and stomach or thor stomach and thorax yeah he's right um, so yeah he's right that's not what we're talking that's not what i'm talking about jess 
What I'm talking about is where the bullet actually impacts versus where it hits the armor. Booter, I'm guessing that's you. Our effects, this should be enough. We'll, uh... You're gonna be able to come again? Yep, perfect. All right, we're just gonna have you guys stand in a line and we're gonna see if BS gets through. We have to do a couple of different specific tests though. So I talked about it a little bit different. My video, uh, my videos with the editor right now, Jess, I talk about it a little bit different. Um, one of the issues we're seeing with like double hit things is that could be a kind of a sideways fix to deal with the double damage bug on the chest, maybe, or issues with fragmentation on the chest, which could explain why we're seeing zero damage sometimes. Yeah, a lot of people are complaining about frames right now, shootable. My guess is there's some bug. not them removing snow i mean well you don't the removing the snow could have broke something cavalier so i wouldn't say that something's obviously not right all right armors off bags off nudie boys line up perfect perfect line like kindergarten facing me facing me we're shooting through you. No, 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 in a line, like, the bullet's gotta pass through all of you. There we go. Okay, sit still. Number three, take like a tiny, tiny step to your right. Half of that. Perfect, I guess. All right, we're gonna see if we can get through. Oh, get nuts to butts, get real close to each other. I like how he just backed up into him without even without without even looking backwards. Okay. Okay, go ahead and heal. Player two, did we do any damage to you? Nope. Player three? Nope. All right, well, we got a blood splatter. That's kind of interesting. Um, everybody take a step to your left. Okay, don't heal this time. Blood splatter. No damage to two. No damage. All right, we're going to try again. Let's see what happens when he dies. Oh, that's your chest. That's your stomach. Yeah, you blocked my stomach. Any damage to two? 
No damage. More three. Try again. Ooh. Okay, go ahead and heal. Okay, both of you crouch down. enough to do penetration it. you love to see it interesting hey we're, we're gonna test and see if you have any nuts stand up real quick <laughs> i'd hope so let's see if they fix this or not for comic relief balls of steel Apparently, balls of tungsten. No, it's not balls of tungsten. It's balls of nothingness. There's nothing there. Uh. You are... Eunuch. All right now, turn around. Be gentle. Does hit back start does hitbox start at belt? No. <laughs> you don't have a butthole either, apparently. <laughs> nope. Nope. stomach <laughs> everything took damage okay so <laughs> i'll show you guys th this isn't new we found this out pretty quick this is what's happening guys <laughs> okay so here's here's what's happening <laughs> uh, oh oops let's do a box <sighs> head nape was the kill yeah, because I shot you in the back of the head. Uh, All right, chat. So this is thorax. This is stomach, okay? The leg hitboxes. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. He's a Gumby, okay? He's Here's the problem. Is this is what the hitboxes look like for the legs. But your clothes look like this, okay? So, if we turn him a little bit, we will get a leg hit. We're just shooting through a tiny little fucking gap between these two hitboxes right here. Like, this is exaggerated, right? We're just shooting through a tiny little gap in that perfect face-on. But if you turn even just a little bit, you're going to catch the leg hitboxes. And that's all that's going on there. Was not that tiny? It is. It's very skinny. Um, hacked. I ha it, You have to try very hard to find that. All right, guys, hang out. We're going to try. I got to try this head hitbox thing. We got to see if there's penetration with stuff. Mind the gap. Yep. He's a stick man. No, like like somebody said, more like Minecraft characters. And that's that's the hitbox. That's not necessarily the colliders of the character. That's the hitbox. Try 338P. I don't have any. BS is more than enough. BS is like what? Uh... BS is 70 pen. So we're we're fine with BS. Got 
got a bunch of type of APM. I was like, nah, it's not about it. it we're just going to see if we can get shots through people to collateral because you used to be able to do it. Um, but it, the head should have collateraled 100% and it didn't. I don't know why. Like they said, the chest and st the, the chest and stomach, right? Perfect. That's what we're gonna we're gonna try different things, Drewski, or Drewzy, Drew, Drewzy C. We're gonna try. Maybe AP slug. What do I do with this golden air taxi? What do you do with the golden air taxi? Brag about it, Lucky Dingle. Thank you for the 12 months. Jess, thank you for the five. Thank you for that super chat, appreciate it. And Miss Phoebes, shit, I wasn't even paying attention. I didn't even see that. I was wrapped up in my own little world. Thank you for the 13 months, Miss Phoebes. 13 months doesn't do justice for how long you've been around. Seems like they removed all but blims. Oh, we're gonna do more head testing, believe me. Nakey, Nakey, line up and takey. All right, so we're gonna test the arm first. So first person, stand up, look straight ahead. Le look up a little bit more, up, 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 up right there. Okay, now you, step forward. no, you're good. Now the guy, number two, I need you to go to your right just a little bit. A little bit more. Keep going. Right there. Now, like three quarter crouch. Don't go all the way down. Oh, that's all the way down. Come up about three quarter. Uh, down a little bit. I don't know how to do that. Ah. So hold C and use your mouse wheel and you'll incrementally. There you go. All right. Hmm. Now we're gonna see if we have penetration through the arm. Actually, we don't need to kill you. Never mind. Stand all the way up. Okay. See if this just impacts you. Did you take any damage? Nothing. Nope. No damage. Okay, we're gonna try a different bullet then. Is your arm blacked? Perfect. Look up. We're gonna try it with a blacked limb, see if that changes anything. Whoops. Nothing. Okay, we're gonna try with... Go ahead and heal up so I don't kill you. Can you heal, or do you need heals? I brought in heals there in the bag. Um. Yeah, yeah, the blood travels through. <laughs> it just teleports behind. Do bullets go armed into torso? I'll check that too, Gallagher. It's a good thing to bring up. 
All right, now we're going to test legs. So crouch all the way down. No, 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 it's number two. Sorry, number one, stand up. Number two, crouch all the way down. Or number one, stand up. No arm pin is a good thing. Are you standing? Uh, run around and come back to where you were. Nice little bug. Oh, you Ooh. can get through legs. Do we? I hit your Blacked leg, right? Out le blacked out my arm. Did yeah. damage to everything. Is your leg blacked? Leave it black yes. if it's black. Leave it black. Let's see if we still get a pen on a black. Number three, crouch down. Ah, look at that. Okay, uh, go ahead and heal up. Want me to heal my arm? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, ahead and, go ahead and fix everything. We're going to see if rounds get through limbs to the chest now. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. I'm not worried about damage. We're just seeing if it actually gets through. When you're full up, let me know. Here, uh... Pick up my M4. And then ADS it. Is your left arm still good? Your left arm's not blacked, right? Left arm was black. Fuck, uh, where's my... Okay, no, it's not. All right, uh, so ADS. We're gonna see if we get a thorax shot on you here. Did you get to your thorax? Yeah, thorax. Thorax and my other arm is black, so both arms are black now. All right, uh, heal your thorax, or tell me when it's healed so I can shoot you again. It's full. All right, tell me if this gets through. Nothing to me. Uh, just, just uh, collateral damage. Just collateral. It didn't get no, to. You. It no didn't direct. get to your chest. No direct. Nothing direct. Oh, no. that's actually really good. I'm pop this Z this real quick. All right. Oh, that's actually really good. All right, we're gonna try again. You, you, your thorax full. Uh, uh, let me pop an ECG. No, it's upper arm versus lower arm. We're able to penetrate the upper arm or the lower arm, but not the upper arm, I'm guess. Number three, are you full right, health? Full. Yeah, um, okay. I'm stream, I'm sitting down and I'm standing. Yeah, it's a, it's a bug we run into quite a bit. Uh, run, okay, okay. run around and stand to his... Uh, healed, yeah. Run around and stand to his right real quick. Um, I'm going to try to shoot through his lower arm and see if I get a pen on you. I'm full, so whenever it's look, fine. Look a little bit more forward. Okay, right there. All right, hold still. That's a little embarrassing. Happens to everyone. So we we hit you, right? We we hit you there. Oh my god! Yeah. Okay, go ahead and heal. Everybody ready? Yeah. Nothing. 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 Just your arm, right? Yeah, right through the arm. Okay, go back into your inventory real quick. Sit like that after you heal. Arm? Yeah, arm again. They've made arms level seven armor, everybody. Except the forearm. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. All right. 
Uh, crouch down, number one. Meat shields. Number two, do like, or number three, do like a half crouch. Yeah, right there. Like this? Okay. Yep. Got me, got me. No damage. No, you got me. Oh, I did get you? Like half thorax gone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Light bleed and half thorax. Whoa. Okay, line up, 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 line up. So the neck. We were able to penetrate the neck. Okay, number two, stand up. You might need to run. You might be bugged. Okay, uh, line up and poofy jacket. You crouch down. I'm going to see if I can get through your head without crazy deflection. Number, uh, uh, God, I got your name right here. Why can't I say it? Um, the Matrix, move forward here real quick, like right up against him. I want to make sure we don't get like a weird deflection. Like get as close to him as you can, because I'm going to shoot through his head and see if it hits you. Like on him, climb on, like get to him. Oh, you are in him. What the hell? Oh, that one hit. All right, chat, here's what I was going to show you with the hitboxes. So when he's here like this, watch. No hits, right? We're shooting right through him. And yes, there's a little bit of hide over bore going there, but I mean, we can get all the way up into here and not hit him. But if I come even like a little bit this direction, we're hitting him. The gap is very, very small. That gap is very, 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 it's like a canyon. We're Kendall's. So, whoops. Okay, so here are the conclusions. Um, I want to do more testing on the neck. I want to verify that the neck is doing that. So we'll hop back in and test the neck again. I need something with a little bit more accuracy though. I mean, a a MAIAP will work. We'll just, sh we'll just keep shooting MAIAP, right? That'll work. SSAAP, sorry, wrong one. Okay, I'm done. I forgot to turn off scabs once, it was funny. Posture check. Yeah, I am kind of slouching right now. I'm just chilling. 
You're welcome. Zlack. Bring in Warmage and see if it pens? No. This is super interesting. Have I seen the fix for blunt damage? We have seen several things with armor today, yes. Did I try shooting through stomach side to side? We did not. I mean, I guess we can try that. What are the initial results of testing? Armor is working how it is supposed to and also not working how it's supposed to. They reduced the ear hitbox. Yes, Dr. Crisis, it is. Okay, how are we going to test this one, I wonder? M61 in that, if you want, man. And you can push it, huh? Do, 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 do. Call. Okay, um, let's test a side pin. So one of you stand and look like way up in the air so your arms are out of the way. And then somebody's got to stand to his side. What happens if you're holding a gun? Does it get the, are you more out, are your hand, arms more out of the way if you're holding the gun? Yeah, there we go. Okay. Side penetration test. M61, correct? Yes, sir. Did you get any damage? Nothing. Okay, so that answers that. Go ahead and heal. My stomach is gone. Now we got to figure out how to test the neck. All right, stand normal. Mm. Come over here where I can stand up on top of this thing a little bit. Back up a little. Okay, turn to the... Yeah, just turn to your left. Both of you stand behind him, so if the bullet deflects weird, we hit one of you at least. Uh, turn more. More. Perfect. All 
All right, whoever's in the middle, move to your right, or yeah, your left, just a little bit more. A little bit more, a little bit right there. All right. Crouch down, uh, Puffy Jacket Man. Not that far, go about a half a crouch. Keep coming up. Okay. Uh, number three, move to your uh, left, just a smidge. Uh, left. Try again. There we go. All right. Let me know in chat if this is actually, it hits you in the neck, all right? Yep. Yeah, no, I'm t making sure I got the shot to hit right. damage to either of you guys, right? No. Where did we pin on that shot then, I wonder? Because we did shoot him through the neck. Okay, look up. Head neck, wait, head neck, head neck, it did get you neck, Buterfee. Okay, don't look up so extreme, whoever's in front. Yeah, right there. Okay, so we did hit the neck. All right, let me know if I hit you in the neck here or not. We got a collateral there. <sighs> Head throat, yep. Head throat, okay. All right, well, let's test the head again. We're gonna test the head again. And you got head face? <laughs> Let's see if the head is really stopping bullets or if we had something weird happen. Some parts. No, Mario, there's a bug. Mario, I'll show you how to do the bug. Exit your game, like completely close it down, load it up. Look at your fuel, like how much fuel you have in a one of your full fuel tanks, your full fuel cans. Start a scav raid, but back out of it right away, right? Just go into a scav raid and back out. And then you'll see it change. It's a bug from last wipe. Well, we, no, we penetrated the neck, Drewski, on one before. I'm wondering if the bullet went through and deflected away and missed them with the first one. Because that can happen. The bullets can change directions. Decals are not reliable, super reliable, Mr. Rip. That's the problem. So it doesn't do any. So it doesn't do anything. Golden plays. What happens? There's a dis there's some kind of display bug in the hideout, and when you go into a scav raid and back out of a scav raid, it does something weird with the back end on your computer and resets a bunch of stuff, right? So like for example, if your flea market, like you know, if you post something on the flea market and you pull it off, 
it doesn't go it comes off the flea market but your slot's still taken up if you do that thing where you go into the you go in as a scab and back out it resets that Yes, Xenomorph, lots of people are having trouble with scavs. <laughs> chronic. True, very true, Chronic, but I'm actually kind of having fun now. This one isn't like mind-bending testing. This is this is more entertaining testing, in my opinion. is telling me that there's something wrong with CPU utilization right now, which a lot of, in the past when this has happened is pretty easy fix for BSG. Okay. Um more neck testing so let's get lined wait we're gonna is that what i was gonna test was necks oh no we're gonna test head okay so number one crouch all the way down the two of you get behind him and like cover it so if there's any kind of bullet deflection at all it hits you guys so make sure you're like overlapped there you go nope come back there you yep So middle, come to your right a little bit. You guys are going to be next to each other. You're going to kind of be stacked behind, front and back, and then you're going to use that to overlap each other. Okay, uh, number two, come stand right here. Okay, see how I'm like right on this guy? Like half quarter behind him. A little bit back to your left, or your right, sorry. Okay, perfect. Right there, uh, the, two, the two of you stand up a little bit. Okay, that works. Now, nope, nope, not you. Middle guy, um, move to your right. Just a smoke, just a scoosh. There you go, perfect, perfect. Front guy, look up a little bit. Any damage to you guys? I like the hitbox, the head hitbox is going through, guys. Nothing. Let's try a different direction here. Come stand against the conics. Let's see if we can get a, a decal through your neck. Turn sideways. We got through on that one. Let me make make sure to tell me if that's uh, uh, a neck kill or not.
Dead bodies are bulletproof, yes. How's it going? Um, we're trying to decide what we're going to do next, if we're going to do anything next. Nah, okay. Well, I think mostly we're... just to yeah. come and say hi, and I'm a fan. And... Yeah. We appreciate it, dude. No problem. Take it, you've probably been playing all day. No, we just got on a little bit ago. I was working on videos and stuff. Just going through ah, cool. stuff. Uh, um, trying to see if there's any other things to test right now. I'm just looking through the patch notes real quick. Yeah, it was a pretty decent sized patch. Chat, you guys got anything else? Yeah, I hope they make the snow or not snow like a seasonal thing. Maybe rotate it through a course of like two or three weeks or so add some variety yeah we'll see what they do i was kind of disappointed that they didn't go there wasn't like an intermediate season it just went back to normal which is fine it's not super disappointed but mm -hmm. yeah, I've, I've never worked on like the coding and end of things well never really worked in computers at all and i don't really know like how hard that sort of thing is to do so it's like i feel unreasonable making demands even if it's like yeah it would be cooler to do it this way it's like but then there's all that back end work that i don't have a clue about yeah it's all beyond me all right <sighs> Yeah, we tested all the, the face stuff. It looks like they reduced the eye hitbox. <sighs> yeah, the ear hitbox is reduced. It's hard to tell. I think they reduced the eye hitbox, but it's kind of hard to tell. Um... They 100% reduced the ear hitbox. I'm trying to decide if we test any more of this stuff on plates. Yeah, good things to know. Shove a plate and damage someone else. No, the I guess when you get to max heavy armor, max heavy vests has a ricochet potential on it, or it used to. 
don't know if it still does. Kberg, thank you for the prime. That panda, thank you for the tier one, tier one. And Elliot's. Thank you for the raid. I hope your stream was good. We are just trying to decide if I'm gonna test any more armor. And I'm kind of like not, I, I'm not feeling it right now. All right, guys, I think we're gonna wrap her up there. Thanks for the help. Um, I'm gonna actually play some Tarkov now though, instead of test Get something out of the day. Appreciate the help though, guys. No problem. Uh, get out. Okay. Now I gotta get my stash on fuck again. It's, honestly, this is probably the most annoying thing about doing testing. It's just everything I have to move around. Plus four, plus four. Away still. Vendor that. Vendor these. that away we'll use that because we'll use it again i'm sure there will be probably more testing in the future okay Fancy site. Nice tombstone or tomb slice. Good job, dude. Oh, yeah, baby burger. How did testing go? Uh, the good news is armor works as advertised.
I'm gonna take on the recoil changes of the pistol and the SKS. Um, I guess we can just go through it here real quick. So, uh, specifically, specifically with the pistols, here's what we're seeing so far. And most people are not gonna like this, just so everybody's aware, you're not gonna like the, the pistol, the pistols got nerfed pretty big. It's just a matter of if people, if it's an, and if it's the end of the world or not, that's all on personal perspective, right? I don't think the pistol changes are good. I also don't think they really matter all that much. Um, I'll show you the two instances that really, um, really exemplify this, shall we say. Mm, this one, right? Yep. Okay. So first up, pistols, the recoil. Let me get the lighting correct on here. So first up, let's put the poppers down. Wait, what? There we go. Okay. So for pistol recoil, if you rapid fire a pistol, you're going to shoot high. Okay. I didn't do anything there. There was no, I didn't pull down. I didn't do any recoil. I, di I didn't try to counter the shooting. Okay. Just, I just let the gun shoot. Now, if you cadence fire, you're pretty good, right? Or if you take a little bit of time and try to pull your shots down, Nice, good. You can get your shots down. It's just gonna take a little practice, right? So Eleanor, Jet, and Olivia oh no, you're a fine house girl. Also got them. Um, Adeline and Clara, Clara didn't as well. Adeline has them. We need to be able to get out there. She has them. Everything to be real. And she can't play with anyone else. And um, oh, she doesn't really like Clara because she shrieks when we play that game and it's like and it's so noisy like you she's you get loud too game. though you want to know her we'll play Mama Mama Mama. she literally screams at the top of her lungs and everybody has to plug their ears and stop the game and tell her to stop because it's so loud i'm okay Okay, now here's where pistols really suck. If you have a red dot, because the red dots are pretty much useless again. Because you can see how the dot pretty much, you lose the dot entirely. So it's kind of a guess. Daddy, you're bad at shooting. I'm... So if you want to rapid fire with a red dot, I mean, you can do it, but you're kind of guessing.
I don't think I can put a... Can I put a red dot on that? Or a laser. So, the other thing you're going to be able to do... No. You said I was bad at shooting. You're being. Get out of here. So, if you have a laser on your gun... You're going to be able to rapid fire. You just got to use the laser. So if you've got a laser, what's the point of a red dot? Right? What? No. Oh. Why would they do that though? Um, I don't know that it's intentional. It might be. So here's here's the basically what's happening is uh, the pistol is you're losing your sight picture. The pistol's hitting where it's aiming. You're just not aiming down the sights right. So I will we'll try this again on fresh paper here. So that's not even ADSing, right? So your shots are going to be a little wild, but you're still able to hit what you're aiming at. What about the full auto Glock? I mean, sure, I guess we can fucking try it out. Full auto Glock's a dumb in my, I don't, anybody who's like, they broke the game because the full auto Glock is not usable. That's just somebody looking for something to bitch about, in my opinion. That's not actually something meaningful. The bigger problem is, is what did they change that makes the Glock these, what did they change, right? What did they change that makes things not work correctly? That's what people need to be worried about. Who cares about the fucking full auto Glock? To be honest with you. My opinion, you might love the full auto Glock. I might be like really raining on your parade right now. Differences of opinions, right? It does look weird. Like what's going on there? I don't know. Daddy, you got two holes there. Two, there's like four there. The one, two, three, four. Circle counts. Yeah, circle counts. Well, without the circle, you got two. I don't know what's going on there. I don't care Happy what's going 11, on there. Happy 11, big man. I was going to read all the patch notes for this update, but I'm going to wait for your video to be released. It's probably really close. YouTube, the editor's uploading it right now, so we should have it up shortly. I don't know any. This thing right here? That one? That means they went to TwitchCon Vegas. Same place I went. Snow's gone, yep.
Because if you look at the regular Glocks. You're hitting right where the laser is pointing. This, yeah, the, the Glock 18 isn't working properly, but like, okay. Yeah. She wants to show you her bracelet. Who gave that to you? It was a friendship bracelet? Somebody gave that to you? Yeah, Asha. Asha gave that to you? It was nice of her. Patch notes mentioned SKS change. Yeah, the recoil is just higher. It's got a lot more recoil, basically, is what it is. Thank you, Hat. Thank you, Bat Panda. Thank you, Devil Parrot. Well, my friend got it in Belize because she was there for five days. Oh, she got that in Belize? Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, my dad has six brains. GP coins worth keeping or selling? It depends on if you want to use them for the barters or not. Um, Don't worry, so body. I use this Gen 4 barter a lot. Um, there's some weapon barters in here. Like this is actually a pretty good barter because you get some really good parts. Um, is this a good barter? Six, that's what? 180,000 for this? That's probably not a very good barter. That's not a too bad of a barter. So armor is back to being good. Uh, yeah, ish. Thoughts on snow leaving? I haven't even played yet, so. Later, Oscar. Do we just run eight five six? Go from there. I think. Ambino. Thank you for the raid, dude. Hope your stream was good. Frame drop, yeah. Uh, Shrizzle is saying that it's a... CPU utilization thing. see what shrizzle has up here i don't think there's any audio with this who's this holy shit frames cut in half literally when he looks over that direction You want to ban him? Yes. Chat, somebody spam. Oh. Okay, go ahead. Marco, God, you 
Oh, oh, hang on. Where is he? Oh, the spam filters caught it, I think. Maybe. Why can't we hear? There we go. Oh, there we go. Okay. Uh, nope. Put user, hide user on this channel. She needs a mod station. Yeah, they don't get their own computers yet. How's armor? Is it better? Seems to be. I'm sad that they got rid of the blunt reduction, but um, it is what it is. Or the zero blunt damage on plates. I'm sad that they got rid of that, but it's not the end of the world. I think the biggest problem is right now um, that there's a CPU utilization issue. Um, If B I'm just trying to see if BSG acknowledged the um performance issue. Any idea how fast they might fix it? Uh something like that they usually do pretty quick. They usually fix uh, performance. We've had this CPU utilization thing in the past. And I mean, within a day, sometimes even faster. Uh, part of the problem is right now is it is two in the morning in Moscow time. So I wouldn't expect anything for at least another, I think 10 hours would be the most optimistic you could expect. So if it's really bad, um, we'll see how my computer handles it. If it's really bad, we might just, uh, I'm gonna go play, uh, some Broken Arrow or something. We shall see. You thought they were in London? No, they're in St. Petersburg. St. Petersburg, Russia. You have zero issues? <laughs> they have a corporate office in London? <laughs> they have a rented office space and PO box in London. That's what they have. I don't even know that there's any people in London. 
I would be shocked if there were. What is the 55A1 craft lock find? Um, the dealership tat, the quest where you got to get into Caban's office at, in Lexos with that super rare key that only he drops. That one is the 855A1 craft. Did I just list for 124K? No, I backed, I think I, no. Uh, I had 124 in there and then I hit backspace before I listed it. The tasks are easy for a 55 a one I mean, it, easy is relative, right? What's easy for one guy isn't easy for another. You know what I mean? Just an armor question. Side with an MMAC wearing level five plates. All right, I'm gonna do this here again. This is explained in a couple of my videos, but a lot of people don't watch them. So, can I get an MMAC off of traders? Can you get an MMAC somewhere? I thought there was a barter for it. Is there not a barter for MMAC? I guess on the I guess they're on the fully they're really cheap. Okay. Let's make sure you can see everything real quick. The MMAC. It covers left side, right side, front plate, black back plate. That's without any plates in it. That's all it covers. Okay. So even if you put plates in it. And we got class five plates right here, right? We've got plates in here right I now. I watch almost all your vids, my man. Okay. When we put this on and we look at our character, let me take my uh, gun off. All right. We're going to put this in paint real quick. Corno, Corno Leo, thank you for the 14 months. So let's pull up paint and show you. Let's get rid of the white as much as I can. Okay, so here is your character, right? Your plate covers roughly this area right here. And everything in between. This is what your plate covers. It doesn't matter if it's class three or class five. This is the area your plate covers. Okay. Your thorax hitbox. That is exposed. Is all here. You have no armor coverage anywhere where that red is. A zero pen bullet will do damage to you. 
and most zero pen bullets have a lot of damage so they tend to two tap if not one tap you So does this make sense, Kyle? So armor is useless? No. Exclamation point armor. You'll see my armor video. This is a bad armor. Because it does not cover anything. If you put on a... Do I have a good rig? Let's just get a baggerly because I, I, I wanted I want to give them a try anyways. Can you not do a bar? Is there not a baggerly barter anymore? God, my flea market bugged out. Fuck it. Just put on the Thor. All right. So the Thor, it covers thorax, stomach, lower back, upper back, left side, right side. Okay. So your character has the same plate coverage. Roughly, it's the same exact shape. It's a different hitbox. You have the same plate coverage, right? If anything gets hit here, you're covered. The difference is, is every hitbox elsewhere is also covered. Even if you get hit in here, it doesn't matter because the armor, the armor lists thorax and stomach. Yeah, it doesn't cover throat. If you want throat, you got to put on, you know, something like a fucking Gen 4. And now your throat hitbox is covered. Server's taking his shit. It sure seems like it. Or at least there was a temporary hiccup right there.
Why, Untar quest? Yeah, this is one of the last quests I have for, uh, um, to get Lightkeeper. I need one more on Interchange, 12 on Woods, 12 on Shoreline. People are saying there's problems with scavs uh, spawning too, though, huh? I mean, I saw somebody say, but like literally say that they had zero scabs on a raid, like anywhere. I don't know how much weight to, I don't know how much to even believe that anymore. Um, ooh. <laughs> Side plates still not working? Side plates work fine. I get I get ones that get hit all the time. Yeah, player scavs different from we're talking AI scavs. I think Gamma Pouch will return to buy without EOD? No. But I also didn't think they were going to add slot space to buy either. Raken, so. <sighs> Take it for what it's worth. My opinion, that is. It's like the servers are trying really hard <laughs> to just stay afloat. Really, really hard. Whoa, did we actually get insurance? Do I care that stash base can be bought? No. In fact, can I get the YouTube video up? Uh, can I get a YouTube video up fat it in the time it takes to get into a raid? Holy shit, the patch notes video was 30 minutes long? Oh, I didn't know I went that long. Sorry, guys. What did I put on the thumbnail again? Where is it? Where is my thumbnail that I just did? There it is. There might not be enough color contrast on that. That was hard for me to see in the list. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Oops. Wrong. Two minutes. Five. Eight. Eleven. Fourteen. Seventeen. Twenty. Damn, we still got more ads space. 
I can already see all the people right now that are freaking out because they don't understand what this means. You will not see an ad every one of these spots, just so you know. It's not how it works. Wait, how, what did I screw up here? How did I screw my math up? Right there. There we go. <laughs> ah okay we're gonna get inside and then i will uh get that live I only need one scab kill. Is there an option to not get pre-roll ads? Yeah, I could turn pre-roll ads off. I don't. Plus, in some instances, whether I have them on or not, BSG or BSG, uh, YouTube will turn them on just for themselves. Okay, we're going to post up right here. Get the YouTube video live because I screwed this up. Import from video. Then we want to change this one to... What was it? Presets, I believe. That's what I was going after. Yeah, there we go. All right. That one's best for viewer. Uh, public... Publish. I think we're ready. Okay. Easy as that.
I think one dude just died to a scav. I didn't see him, chat. I saw the scav. But I didn't want to shoot the scav. Three man below you. I think it's a four man because one of them died to the scav. Tour still up, if not more. There might be another team up too. What gun is that?
I didn't feel like I potatoed a lot of those shots, but I obviously didn't hit him. Twice I thought he went down, but he must have just gone prone or... No, my computer was lagging when I got into that fight. Because the airplane came in. FPS issue? Yeah, the one you get when the airplane comes in. <laughs> what am I using the multi-stream? OBS with uh Atom, or whatever it's called. <laughs> you ratting? No. I guess it depends on what your turn. What? I guess it depends on what your definition of ratting is. What is happening? I just got into a fight with a guy that has a Tagilla mask on. And that was after I killed one of a four man. Airplane flew over, flew over and gave me really bad stutters. So I wanted to reset the fight a little bit. So now I'm just waiting to hear uh, audio to move on. Because I have no idea where anybody's at right now. He posted up right there, but I'm betting he pushed back that way. I don't dare push that way in case he's holding that same angle. Did I get a chance to watch Microsoft security video? Didn't even know there was one. Is there anything?
If I had to guess, I'd say Mr. Tagila Mask Man. Ran back over here and continued around, maybe? He might still be over here somewhere, though. Ты куда пошел? Well, that ruined that flank. Oh, no, I haven't watched that yet, Flighty Modem. I actually, honestly, dude, I forgot completely about it. I didn't even check this. The fucking Tagila mask guy could be over here. Fuck. He ran underneath. I 
feel like he knows I'm up here. Trying to tell if he's headed that way with sound or not. He was headed this way. Did the fourth just die? Somebody's looting right underneath me. Whoever that is, is leaving. We're gonna go with lower pen, but no tracers. That's a dead body, right?
just heard steps over there. Can't tell if they're underneath or not, though. That's somebody coming up right there. So ST used to be a flush ammo. It's better than 855. Just barely. have to imagine those are player scabs over there that we heard running by. How am I on decontamination? How many more do I need? A lot. Hate that glass effect, dude.
feel like the other ones all ran off. That's a player. Didn't even see him. Did he peek me when I fucking was sitting right there? It was a pretty good angle to see me on. <laughs> he must have. That was a player scav chat, and we got him with the M67. It wasn't a Tagilla mask guy, it was a player scav. And he was dead. I should have been more patient and waited till I got an angle on both of them to take the shot. Because they were looting, I could have got to both of them before they got out of their looting. I hate tracers, dude. Tracers, they just give you away so easily. got more more where that came from guess I didn't mean to pick that that must have been Jesse's okay Shoreline and woods. I didn't even look at my dailies. Oh, I got one of those squirreled away. <sighs> 50 scaps from over 35 meters. On reserve. Exit customs through crossroads. It's actually harder than it looks because you end up... Um... Man, I hate bringing 855A1 in, man, but... I think we have to. Whoop. 
Oops. And we just put 10 on top to try to be sneaky, but not burn through our ammo. We might have to go to a one to six for shoreline too. Trying to decide. You miss being able to buy them for lowers. It's really not that expensive though to do a new one. In all honesty. Dogs up here sniffing around. Sammy. Come here, Sammy. Come here, Sammy. Hi. The stream wants to see you. Yeah, the stream. Oh, yeah. Downstairs before she goes potty up here or something, okay? That one is a sheet of puppy. Yeah, I gotta see her. Come on. Ah, come here. I, I gotta take her. Kids grow too fast. They do indeed, man. I mean, they do and they don't, right? I am enjoying my children as they grow older and change and grow up into little humans. Um, I'm enjoying that process a great deal. You know what? There is a Red Rebel Extract. I should probably bring stuff to do that, huh? Let's 
scabbing streets is busted. Yeah, there's some kind of bug, it looks like. Could be an old one. All right, we'll see if this, uh, how this feels. This is, this is one of the maps a lot of people have been struggling on. Oh my goodness. It looks so different with grass. This is a pretty popular player scav spot, so I think I'm gonna go see if I can find a cheeky spot to hide to cover the camp. And dink player scavs and regular scavs, because we need to kill them for a task anyways. I didn't even check our shoreline keys through the roof. Snow was removed today, yes. But it's so dark, dude. I just hear bushes in front of me. Am I about to die?
Cloud speed changes kind of based on how windy it is. Take Eagle Mike. Okay, so the question is Can I successfully sit out here? I kind of want to get up here. I don't know if I can get up there without dying. Now we wait for unsuspecting player scabs. We'll check a couple of ranges here. The other spot would probably be the other side would be better but i think you hit landmines over there to be honest with you what nice didn't that crate drop like right here somewhere or is it way farther away Blue armor definitely doesn't make me hide any better. Would you say, kiddo? A new part of a map they added. Yo, it legit looks like a storm front over there almost. Mm -hmm. You can go pretty far back and not hit the mines. Yeah, up on this side. That side, I don't know. If I have a feeling you go up here, you're dead. Or up on the other ridge. <laughs> yeah, they got rid of... You didn't even say anything. They got rid of the snow today. Flowers and tweeting birds and death. Well, the birds don't care about... A war zone, they just do their thing. 
right? Love you. Love you too, kiddo. Fog 200 meters away. I mean, it's I don't care as so much about the fog as the bad lighting. Like, you have this global illumination around you, and it's a bubble, and you can see like 150 meters lit well, but you get past that and it just gets dark. That sounded like a. A GL that just landed. Yes. Denial. Question is, do we get any player scabs that stroll up here that I can kill? Yeah, we're running 70 frames right now. I should be over 100, so. Yeah. Something's wrong with the game. Scabs at a distance or scabs with Umtar? Just scabs with Umtar. But we also have to kill scabs here specifically for a task. So I was kind of hoping to get a couple player scabs. Because player scabs love to loot this. And we got a few more minutes before they spawn in. But... I'm hopeful we don't stand out all that much at this distance. But I think I'm being a little over optimistic, especially being crouched like that. I should probably get prone. Make myself a little bit harder to see. And wait, stuck in waiting session start for your fourth scab run. Which uh, maps have you tried, Fats? Is it all on streets or have you tried different ones? Reserves, custom streets and factories, so it's it's across them. Because it, it, there was a lot, a long time where it was just a, or there was a time where it was just a streets issue. You could get into other ma maps pretty much fine. Whoa. Um. I'm going to be upset if we sit up here all raid and no scabs show up. Because the other thing we could do is we could use the joint extract. Because joint extract's right there. Of course, we have car right to our right. Oh, I probably didn't bring money, did I? Nope.
It seems like it's so it's a it's a CPU utilization issue. Um, my guess is they'll probably have it fixed by tomorrow, guys. Why are there so many hackers in Tarkov and why is it such an issue to fix this? What makes you think Tarkov has more cheaters in it than other games? Not a leading question, I, a serious question as to how you get to that conclusion. Have I seen the LOD and field of view issue with loading PM scavs at distance? No. Tarkov has more RMT than other games? No, it doesn't. It has more RMT than Call of Duty, but Call of Duty doesn't have a marketplace. Call of Duty doesn't have power leveling. You go look at any other RTS, or sorry, not RTS, MMO style game. That has level progression and shit, and to be honest with you, Tarkov doesn't even shake a stick at it. Cheating is an industry problem, not a Tarkov problem. BSG can't solve it. Activision can't solve it. EA Sports can't solve it. Blizzard can't solve it. Nobody has solved the cheating issue. Valorant hasn't solved it. Valorant was just the first company to go on a different path um, and have the most... Six Valorant's approach, and now Call of Duty's approach, is to limit the impact cheaters have on everyday players. Instead of trying to beat them, they try to isolate them and make sure that they're not harming the gaming experience of everybody else. That's their primary goal now. So the fact that the biggest gaming companies in the world have all but given up trying to stop cheating as their primary goal, they still do. They still have anti-cheat measures, but it's not their primary method anymore. They also spend, they pro, I, they, no, they don't ever talk about how much they spend, but I bet the big companies probably spend more money on anti-cheat than BSG's entire budget, if I had to guess. At least I would say that's the way with Call of I know that's the truth with Valorant because um, of what they did to create their anti-cheat system for Valorant. Um, but my guess is looking at what Call of Duty is currently doing, I think it's a safe bet as well. How does BSG make money? They sell accounts and now soon sell stash space. I think it's a huge misunderstanding to assume 
that BSG has to have monthly recurring revenue to be able to afford to develop a game. When the game blew up in 2020, it was comparable to BSG winning the lottery. So many people bought the game in 2020, December, that they had a windfall of revenue. And as long as they manage that revenue properly, maintaining reoccurring revenue isn't necessarily a problem. Kooky, you could just go back and watch the start of the stream too, man. Handy thing on YouTube, you can just go all the way back and catch the parts and fast forward through the stash stuff and the loading. Why is the green battery worth so much? Because you barter it for a Bitcoin and Bitcoins are 600k now. Yeah, I don't know the rules around that stuff, though, Omni. I don't trust those numbers all that much. Not because BSG, I think BSG is untrustworthy, but because companies report when, when you're not a publicly traded company, you kind the, the way what you report on stuff like that is very fungible. What is my current LOD and field of view? Uh, 65 and... I don't know, what's my LOD? Four. Cranked, everything cranked up. Sixty, green batteries is 60 around barter right on. That's not driving the cost up though. If you watch between bar, after mechanic resets, green battery price goes way down when mechanic resets the price goes way up so bitcoin barter mispriced i don't know for the longest time the bitcoin barter wasn't worth doing because the vendor prices alone of the four components were worth more than bitcoin since its inception i believe bitcoin has spent more time under 200k than over 200k i could be wrong about that but I'm honestly surprised we didn't get any player scabs to run out here. And yeah, it might be a little early still, but stuck a waiting session start yeah maybe oh at like 15 minutes i'll probably work my way into resort to see what doors have been opened and not I suppose we could have our lunch, though, huh? Money is not hard to make. Money is not hard to make for you. There are a lot of people that play this game that don't have anywhere between there are there are somewhere between a million and two million. And by a lot, I mean more than half of the player base is probably under two million rubles right now. We could do a poll. Um
I agree with you in principle that there is much better stuff to do with your time, like learn how to get better at making money. But I wonder if it's because I'm all the way up here and nobody comes back over here and they only loot down below. Tips for Punisher Part 4? Which one is that? I know scav vest kills. Oh. Do it, I mean, you can do it with a sniper rifle um, because you don't have, they don't require big rigs to do anything. Um, or even a semi-auto gun and put like, you know, 20 rounders in an M4, only take up one slot and just shoot. Make sure you're suppressed and just shoot shit from a long ways away. Lighthouse. I think should get easier now that all the foliage is back. It should be much easier to move around um, and stay in cover than it was before. It was legitimately very difficult to get around Lighthouse um, with the snow, even for somebody who knew what they were doing because of... Uh, um, the lack of foliage. It should be substantially easier now, though. Okay. actually worth kind of a lot. drive some poor soul probably needs. I feel like I always need those for dailies and I never find them. Somebody took car out already. Raids are screwed. Yeah, I've heard there's some issues. Those are expensive. I think those are 545 or 54R.
<laughs> Anyone missing the snow? I mean, it's been all of a day. I'm sure there's somebody out there who is like, oh, I love the snow. But I think most people were ready for a change. Whether Even if you liked the snow, I think people were ready for a change. I was. I like the snow. But was also ready for a change. I'll bet my buckwheats are probably like 30k, aren't they? Lots of alls. Patch has been complete dog shit for today. Oh, I don't know. I feel like that might be a little over the top. It's got problems, but stuff will get corrected. Always does. Oh, that's 120 of 7 and 40. Oh, well then. Probably not a great idea to go up into resort, but I want to go see if the doors have been opened. It's really weird that nobody came this way. Did I hear gunshots? Yeah, we heard a couple of grenades, a couple of gunshots. There was a GL that hit on the other side of the map. Can't wait till they re rework all visuals. Man, I'm worried about... I mean, Nikita was worried about the visual rework. I, so that makes me worried about the visual rework. You think they should display pen value on inspect? I don't see why they sh any reason why they shouldn't. I think they're planning on doing it. got a system like that in um and what's it called uh arena right now so i think it's safe to assume that we'll see it eventually they've said they want to do it So this room didn't get unlocked. That was kind of nice. It does make me wonder if it even got looted. Wait, did I go? Hmm. 
interesting. I did not expect to see that unlooted. Somebody could have just missed it, though. There's no, there's usually like three weapon crates in here. That's interesting. Do I play any servers? It's all I can play, man. Commit a little bit of insurance fraud, huh? Are we close to, yeah, I was going to say, are we close to 10 minutes here? out of there, so it's kind of hard for me to show it to you. Did they definitely fix vaulting through shoreline doors? I don't know. I don't know how to do it. I never tried to do it. Um, I wouldn't try right now. That's actually worth some money. Shoreline. Mm. One raid does not constitute proof of a nerf. there's definitely a chance they turn loot down a little bit um but we shall see Morning about fucking 20k loot. I'm gonna go see if 301's hit real quick. me out. It makes me think there's a flashlight or something. Hmm. 
All right. Yeah, only those three. Boom, get rid of one of these. Put that up there. Take that. Okay. Whatever. The motor is 100k. We're headed for extract. Sniper stabs, man. Bastards. Wait, what? What's up, Jack? Not doing too bad, man. I think maybe I killed that sniper scav. It looked like he kind of flinched when I shot. I only, I didn't kill him.
pick. Well, we made good money. What's with the attitude, little miss? No, you just had an attitude. That was attitude delicious right there. It was. Hey. <laughs> We're going to sit on that. I'll bet that's a little bit more expensive later. That's not worth as much as I thought. Okay. All right, well, we went to Shoreline to kill scabs and we didn't kill any scabs. So instead of camping, I guess we will uh, roam. You hope they'll fix SPS issues soon. Unless it's like a major problem, I don't see any reason why they won't be fixed by probably maybe tomorrow. maybe an optimistic outlook on it but whenever we've had these kind of things in the past they usually fix them pretty quickly Scabs this time. Pistol recoil kind of wild. Pistol recoil has issues, yes. I feel like more people use the SKS than people use pistols, and everybody's bitching about the pistols more than the SKS, which I think is an indication of some people just bitch for the sake of bitching.
Do, 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 do. What's the difference between insuring with therapist and proper? Uh, therapist is more expensive. Therapist comes back faster. Therapists lasts longer before it times out. Oh, 100, pistols 100% needed a nerf. They had no recoil. Did they need to go where they did? I don't think so. I think they went too far. And I think it's more buggy than it is actually intended intended change. Because um, I'm seeing inconsistencies when you change like red dots. Yeah, SKS was overpowered, but I think they also went too far on it. I don't think it needs to be where it is now. It's pretty ridiculous. You could put an auto clicker on a pistol and full auto it, basically, and it didn't move. Very little change in recoil. Um, that's not necessary. But where we're at now is not a good change either. So both can be true. I can not like where we were, but also not like where we're at. Damn, I just ran out of stamina. You could see clear as day through here before the patch. I remember bopping a guy from like over here. You cannot see clear as day now, which is interesting. I don't think anybody can beat me here. Oh my god, let me over the fucking sandbags. They make shotguns worse? No, shotguns feel better. I don't think they changed the recoil on them at all. I mean, they might have made it a little bit less. The difference is, is that shotguns feel better now. question I have is how visible am I up here? Probably very visible, huh? If I had to guess. It was interesting to see Shoreline not looted, though. The room's unlocked. Oh, it's all your fault, Shadowville. Punishment for fucking vaulting in and out of rooms. I told you it was cheating. This is just proof. This is our punishment because you had to cheat.
I think the biggest problem we have right now, to be honest with you, is the same problem we always have, is BSG's failure to communicate intent. What is BSG actually after with the changes to the pistol? Nobody knows because BSG doesn't tell anybody. Which means it's impossible to provide feedback, which means everybody just bitches and moans because that's the only thing you can really do. Because what good is feedback if you don't know the direction to give the feedback in? Such a cool bug. I love that bug. The bug. The buzz. The bug where uh, you fucking... Uh, sounds like a bullet. Goes practically oh, yeah. through your fucking head. But you're standing inside and nobody has line of sight on you. So then the only thing you think of is, well... It's bugged or is there a cheater? Are broken again. Well, I mean, a lot of other shit in the game's broken as of right now, so. What else is broken? Should I even load up the um, I don't know. So, the there's a pro problem with CPU utilization. It's kind of like the stuff we see from time to time, where the frames are just absolute dog shit, and then they do a patch to fix something they fucked up, and it fixes it in like a day. But, like, people are getting their frames cut in half on some maps, even with, like, monster machines. Great. That's what I've only played Shoreline and Interchange, and it, I am, like, if I look one direction, I have 140 frames. If I look another, I have 65. Um, that means on Streets you have 22. So, yeah, I haven't played Streets yet. <laughs> but the awaiting session start bug for Scavs is back as well which means that there's probably not any scavs on streets players calves um they nerfed the absolute ever living hell out of skss for some reason um like vengefully nerfed them not like like why the, like the peanuts SKS wasn't even that good anyway like peanut said something about nikita i think like it's that bad um, it, the, the guns wasn't even good to begin with, let alone. Well, no, and yes, it was too. It, it's re, I mean, it's recoil was our, was better than an SR twenty fives stock, right? And like, there's a fucking realism argument for that because the SKS isn't shooting as big of a round. Blah 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 blah. Um, but they went to the moon with the nerf. They also completely jacked up pistols. Yeah, but that's all I've been seeing is fucking... Hey, oh, so God, ring. yeah. So, like, it has something to do with camera recoil. They're still consistent. Like, they're not bef like before where they kind of... Like, it was hard to see where you were actually aiming and shooting. You know, you'd hit low, right? If you spam fired at a certain speed, you just bullets would actually hit low. Um, uh -huh. it doesn't do that. They hit high. If you have a laser on, the laser, they hit where the laser's pointing. Um, which they did that before, but, um, Hi, the, um, there's something fucked up with the, how red dots work on them. Like, red dots are, like, where they were last, like, before patch 14, red dots are back there. The recoil isn't like that, but when you shoot... The damn dot like practically disappears off the fucking screen no. or saying it does it doesn't practically in some cases it does just completely disappear off the screen um well i mean unfortunately for the 02 percent of people that actually use a pistol
I've seen some complaints about scabs being broken, like not spawning, but I don't know how much truth there is to that yet. Um, there was tons of them on interchange, like AI scabs. Um, and even a few player scabs. Um, there, uh, we haven't seen really any on shoreline, but I did camp at the fucking farm the entire raid trying to, um, kill scabs up here. And I'm about to leave the farm right now. Um, probably run into players transitioning because that's my luck. Um... Yeah, I was AI scabs, player scabs, anything to show up. Because I think it's well, kill anything, isn't no, it? Or does it have to be scabs? Gonna, no, it's scabs. But they're not going to spawn if you're there. No, but I was hoping I could kill a couple of player scabs. Um, and we spawned over on the side of the map both times. But somebody took car out, but every room I, ch I didn't have time to check every room in the resort, but every one I did check, including 301 and the second, the good ones, like the really good rooms, none of them were hit. So I think it's safe to say they fixed the vaulting bug. I don't know how else to explain. Oh, I'm not really noticing, like... I'm trying out the 5.7, and, like, there's definitely more recoil, but, like... Put a red dot on a pistol, and you'll see it. That's It's not as bad with iron. Iron sights are not too bad. They're, it's completely manageable with iron sights. That's why it's not just a recoil thing. It has something to do with red dots. Because that was one of the biggest things I noticed. Um... Uh, with 14 pistols was that red dots were actually usable on pistols, even the really bad red dots. But now the really bad red dots are really bad. They didn't update the visual recoil on optics because I use this thing just fine. So I, I mean, if the they did, I mean, maybe that is on the five seven is that there's a lot of sway for it being a pistol. Well, that's that red dot specifically as well, right? That red dot is really bad. Um, well, and yes, it has a lot of it has like right. That. It does. It follows like the it sway reset and it will it will follow that. Like if you sidestep yeah, figure eight. Well, if you yeah, but if you sidestep, it hits where that red dot is, right? The red dot's still accurate. It just moves a lot. Um, and the reason it feels like such shit to everybody is because before the update, they pretty much had, um, the camera on pistols pinned. At zero, yeah. Well, no, 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 it wasn't, it was just pinned, it was locked. It wasn't, it, it still moved with recoil, like there was still camera recoil, but it was, it, I guess it wasn't really camera recoil, but it was pinned to the pistol recoil. So it just didn't move, or it didn't look like it moved, or it didn't feel like it moved, you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, so now that it moves a little bit when you shoot and you don't maintain your sight alignment. Oh my God. I just watched that scav spawn in. I mean, I'd like to see it reset back to where it's at. You know what I mean? Like instead of versus like kind of pe pendulum yeah, like, swing. Like, yeah. Like resets weird. Like that's the only issue I have. I actually, I, I like the way it is right now where like. Right, because I mean, f fucking fast firing a pistol is not the easiest thing in the world. <sighs> no, and it was, in my opinion, it was broken before. Like, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, a lot of people disagree, before. and but like the ability, like, you could fucking put an auto clicker on a pistol and full auto it, and it just right, right, exactly. That's exactly what I'm saying. Is like it used to be like the old M1A where it didn't move, and people would make macros and just spam it as fast as it could go. It was a P90 right, with small move. mags. <laughs> Men, less recoil. 
Yeah, like, I'm okay with the way it is, just if they would make it to where it would reset at least closer to where your shot was at. But I, I also, uh, I already sold the gun, I would try it. I was, I was shooting at like 20 meters, right? Do like, the, maybe, yeah, but do the, the, there's, there's a barter mechanic for two, uh, two big, two WD-40s. Oh, I see if it was cool. Oh my God, I just killed a player. Heading for extract. That guy probably oh, thinks I'm extra. He probably thinks I am. This Glock looks hideous, though. <laughs> So what's the what's the f the second set of um, orange things? What is that? Ten meters? I, uh, I don't remember. It's like four, eight, and fourteen or something on the white on the square targets. Where's my fucking rangefinder at? You can't use a rangefinder. You have to put one on the gun. What does this guy have in here? Super performance, huh? So 13, 13 meters is is what the first one or the second ones are at. Yeah, but it's more about like, like at the middle target. If you if you don't if you aim center of the target and don't adjust your aim at all and just quickly fire, you hit the ceiling, and that's like what a lot of people are complaining about. And it's like. Okay, so that's pull down. How you shoot a pistol. Pull down right, your like, mouse. A, pull down on your mouse a little bit. Sorry right. that Tarkov doesn't completely negate recoil for you anymore. Use a little bit of skill, which is why I'm okay with the change, is because it actually puts a skill gap in there now. I I like it quite a bit actually. Like, like yeah, it, if you just spam it as fast as you can, you're shooting the ceiling. But like, go take a you know a Glock out by yourself at the shooting range and just fucking pull the trigger as fast as you can and see what you hit it's not going to be the target but like you gotta fight it you know shoot it at like a little cadence I actually I like that quite a bit and that's a pretty good change I mean, not that it affects me much. I'm not going to use a pistol, but. You just like the change because it makes it harder for pistol links to shoot you. I don't I mean, I, <laughs> regardless of what it is, like, I think it's pretty fair the way it is. Yeah. Right? Like, you shouldn't be able to spam fire a pistol. I, I said it before, right? I said a little bit before you got in here. The fact that all of the bitching and moaning is about the pistol when the SKS nerf was really the fucking bad one. Oh, that's what I wanted to do was buy an SKS. Like, they really, really nerfed it. Like it's uh, it's hard to say exactly timing without going in and measuring it, but it's it's not exaggerative to say that they, the reset time has been more than has been doubled. They've more than they've put it up to about it takes twice as long to reset on the shot, and the recoil could be as much as like the vertical recoil when you shoot is three maybe four times more, like how high the reticle moves when you shoot with a mm. with a sight on. I didn't really shoot it with irons. The irons it might be fine, but. Like in the aspect of it being broken, quote unquote broken, it's not like you saw people running everywhere around with SKSs, right? Even with its really low recoil, it still has its limitations with mags and ergo and weight. Dude, I'm not seeing like that's not what's happening. Brown, if you watch it, exactly what you said you want is what is happening. The pistol moving is what's causing your sight alignment to fucking come off.
monthly Bezos money. The hell do I have screwed up here? Should have ill. Thank you for the two months, man. Did I don't. Am I stupid? Am I doing this wrong? You get a chance to pull up my screen for yourself. Hang on, I'm just trying to get a couple of more scabs and get off the shoreline. Yeah, again, I'll say it again. It feels really weird, and it's hard to fucking figure out what's going on because BSG doesn't tell us what they want, which those factors right there make it very difficult to get things right. I'm going to reset these. Is there a fucking reset button here? Vonon, on, vonon, on, blet, you... Head over bore caused a couple of problems there. Not gonna lie. More green and bushy. I don't know. People are saying it's more green and bushy. Without doing a one to one comparison. The snow's gone. Seems like I fucking turn my brightness back. Up. I want to go down and check those grenades out, but I also feel like that's just somebody baiting for people to come over there. Across the map, just to fucking die to somebody that close to extract. Like, what the fuck is he doing right there? <sighs> Ratting hard, or just crossing the map? Who? He he was standing outside of bushes. I don't think he was ratting anywhere. Just fucking unlucky for me that we crossed and he heard me first. I don't know what he was doing over there other than maybe ta he, he had some task he was working on maybe. But why he was there at that point in the raid, I do not know.
That's how they watch this. Is this not how it's supposed to? Milton, you ready? Go ahead. All right, so. I mean, like, that's not a terrible spread for just basically spam clicking. Yeah. Try to shoot it like a person normally shoots an SKS. Shoot it like one? Yeah, don't spam fire it. We're not, I'm not talking about spam fire because I'm talking about, like, trying to shoot at somebody at, like, 150 meters. How high the gun jumps up. When you shoot, that right there is way higher than it was. And the time it takes for it to settle back in is way more than it used to be. See, so it's the same issue where like, when you shoot, it goes up, but it, it resets down here. Yeah, it overcompensates. Here, like, it, over, it's... It, sh it should just reset back to there. Yeah, it like, overcompensates. I'm fine with it jumping up, but like, But semi-autos in general have been pretty bad this wipe for whatever reason um, compared to the past. Like semi-auto fire on every gun is not good. Like M shooting the M a M1A was awful, dude. And I usually don't mind shooting the, F shooting the M1A. See, I, I've been liking it, dude. Like, honestly, a lot of times like the so MDR much horizontal recoil, dude. I don't know how you like it. I've been shooting like the AUG in the M1 or in the like the MDR single fire instead of full auto. Like, yeah, those are. I'm not. I'm not. I'm talking about the specific guns. It's like a. It's like the M1A, the SR25. It's those guns. It's not the little ones. So all guns do that. I don't know if they they have they changed all of them. The SR25 is dropping below where the reset is too. Yeah. No. But, but the. Yeah. I know it's been doing that, but it also has a lot of horizontal recoil. That's the thing that really makes those suck is how much it jumps around left and right on the semi-auto guns. I think if I'd had class five on, I might've actually killed that guy. I was just about to reset into um, an ADS fire at him. But class three against 762 PS, nope. a lot of ammo to kill me i mean you hit me with three shots on the chest i wouldn't say you need a lot of ammo we just missed a lot um are you coming shoreline with me yeah I need 
need seven more scabs. is the name of a city in a fictional world. Hit the legs, hit the arms, finish you off after a mag. I mean, screen told me hit me in the chest three times, so. Class five, I can take probably five shots, if not six, from PS. Oh my god. Seven six two PPM was five thousand a round? Jesus. Don't know why. Thank you, chat. I would have forgot. real quick, I'll bear it back.
Yo, I don't even know where I'm at right now. What is this green bullshit? Oh man, this is a great place to. Am I am I in Tarkov? What what is it? I don't even know what I'm doing. What is this map? What is this fucking game? There's green. Yeah, it does feel weird, doesn't it? Where Holy am I? We're we're in a really bad spot, by the way. Yeah. I think. Probably. I don't I don't actually know where I'm at. Okay, yeah, we're in a really bad spot. I need to kill scabs. I just need seven scabs, so I'm gonna try to go get sniper scabs, maybe get some gas, and then uh, go from there. Yep. Oh, there's some scabs up here at radar. All right, weather. Somebody, okay, I'm on the other side of it. Somebody just shot down at construction. Where are they at at weather? There, I heard him yibbery Evan in the building. Or by the building. Where the fuck? Wild, I didn't even hear you shoot, and I was just over on these rocks. That's you running up, right? Yeah. Your stream is running at like three frames a second. Yeah, it's because my computer's fucking struggling. Oh, actually, my Discord stream might be at like a bajillion, too. Let's see here. I was gonna come up here to try to shoot down to gas, but I can't see shit down there because of the oh, fog. Yeah, I mean, you might as well shut off your stream and save the resources, man, because I can't, it, like, it's useless. Fucking slideshow. I can't even see into power from up here. It's weird that it's not running very well. Now it's working fine. All right, that was weird. Because nothing was pegged. I was like, what the fuck? Dude, this fog is bad. I can't see anything. Uh, so, yeah, they definitely changed something with how the game visualizes distance and darkness and fog because, like, there's this weird global illumination effect at, like, 150 meters. Everything just starts to get dark. Oh, no way he one-shot my arm, dude. Sniper scab on top. He's dead. At least one of them is. One is thrown. Yeah, yeah. He's the one that I sh the one that was shooting at you is the one that I shot, but sucks because the whole fucking world knows we're over here now. I couldn't even see him, but he was sure in the fuck able to see me. There might be another one up there. I just heard something jiggle. I don't see any scavs down here. I'm across. I was heading to uh, resort. I'm gonna go over to gas, see if I can get any kiss, not kill, scav kills there. Oh god. I'm dead. A fucking scav just two tapped me, dude.
I couldn't even see him either. Oh, through the bushes. He <laughs> two tapped me in the thorax because of class three shooting T45. Of course he is. Uh, I'm on the other side. The cat scavit killed me. He's on the other side too. He was walking from spine towards power. I'm right at the gate where you run out from the power lines and shit. Okay. Over there, yeah. Just leave my blueberry shit on the ground, it's fine. Oh, I should have had you get a Glock 18 and fuck around with it, because that does do some weird shit. <laughs> there is Another something... Another fucking scam up there, dude. Fuck. I'm sorry, it, Glock 18 with what? Just the Glock 18 is... It, it's broken. Like, there's something weird with it. Fucking, this game looks so weird. With green, yeah. It does make it harder for your fucking GPU to process it though that's for sure no it's not what's going on it's fucking i mean oh, there might yeah, be a I little bit of that shrizzle said that there's a there's a cpu utilization problem right now sorry i forgot you did say that wow there's two scabs out there too fuck that would have been all i needed three scabs there's one crouched there What makes me a rat in this game? I don't know. Being a rat is something entirely subjective based on... That's not a... Oh, it is a scab. I thought that was like a lantern or something. Um, oh, pom -pom. That's a completely subjective descriptor. You could, in a, there's scenarios like where you could, um, you could have just pushed a three man and shattered and completely killed all three of them and just owned the fight, but you're fucked up. So you go and you go to heal real quick just to, you know, get yourself back together and get you ready for another fight. In the middle of that healing process of putting yourself back together and packing mags and doing all that shit, somebody runs up on you and doesn't know you're there because you're not moving because you're healing and packing mags and you kill them and then they call you a rat probably nine times out of ten so it's all about perspective Do, 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 do.
All right, you got what? Got everything but your armor. And your helmet. And my backpack. You can get my backpack, right? Well, yeah. And your backpack on you, too. You got my hemostat and my propital? Mm -hmm. Okay. Armor changed again? Yep. So yeah, I shot 762 by 54 RBS with 70 pen at several body parts. Um, the neck, the lower leg, or the legs and the lower arms, your forearms are the only thing that bullets can get through. Everything else stops them. Hmm. What is the process for reporting to PMC's direct messages? Never done it. Why am I wearing crappy UN gear? Because Peacekeeper is making me. New armor is broken. Not what we saw. It's working really good. You'll have to forgive my skepticism, Wadi. I have had hundreds of people come in here and tell me armor is broken, and every one of them but one person thought the, ar thought the armor was broken because they didn't understand how it works. You were probably the sixth or seventh today alone. There is still something going on that's making bullets not do damage, though. I don't know what it is, Liston. We had like five instances. I mean, out of hundreds of rounds shot, we had, I think, five, four or five rounds that damaged the front plate, but didn't damage the airmen or the player. Hmm. And of course, I think it's the fucking fragment boogeyman because that's what i think everything is now but i don't know how else to explain it but like a, a plate with class three aramid um the bagger got bumped to class three too by the way i don't know if you saw that yeah, sort of, I did see sort that. of the m2 all rig the, all the yeah all the old wait m2 as well yep and uh there was another oh, class oh the trooper the trooper's class three too now I mean, the trooper is still useless because it only protects where the plate's at. But... No, it, it covers chest. It just doesn't cover sides. Interesting. That changes quite a bit. It has thorax action. and upper back and stomach and shit. just doesn't have covers the sides. But, um... Well, I mean, at least that kind of means that the CPC is a plate trash. Or maybe it doesn't. No, it doesn't cover the stomach. It covers. I don't know what it covers. I'd have to go. Yeah, look the at trooper it. doesn't. No, the trooper does. It covers the upper stomach, right? It, it's because the stomach is different now, 
Right, we gotta keep remembering that fucking right underneath your nipples is your stomach. And it does cover that. It doesn't cover like the pelvis, whatever the hell that area is, groin. They weren't ricochets? No. Because they did like five damage to the plate. Or six damage to the plate. They did the same amount of damage to the plate as in all the other shots. Plus ricochets, unless there's bug, there are no ricochets on body armor. Unless you have max heavy armor. Shades, thank you for the three months. How different are the pistols, SKS, and shotguns after the patch? Oh, well, quite a bit. You'll know. I mean, go shoot one. You'll notice right away. Each plate had a ricochet chance if it was steel titanium. No, that's news to me. Trees are all new here, dude. Aren't they? This wipe? Oh, down here? I know they were. They are. Yeah, all these trees and foliage down here are new on the island. Like between the lighthouse and... Oh, um, yeah. I feel like I'm going to get shot from the right crossing right here, but behind us or whatever. Didn't really stand out before because of the snow and stuff, but definitely stand out now. Heard from Tower? Yeah, we played uh, some satisfactory with him this weekend. He's been doing a lot of Dungeon and Dragons lately, so that's ate up a lot of his time. He's been taking a break from the traditional games. I say traditional uh, video games. I think the 28 perchable stash lines are going to stack with Terra Goop Trail. Yeah, I think it's going to stack with everything, including EOD. Oh, so they did say it's going to be 28 lines? Uh, yep. That's what Nikita said on Reddit. Um, I don't know what that shot was, but I feel like it... Man, that sounds, does that sound weird to you? It sounded really far, and then it sounded really close. There's somebody at power here, I'm pretty sure, but I don't know what gun it is, dude. Sounds like an M700. Oh, an MP18, maybe? I mean, I can't say it's not. Who's running an MP18, to be honest with you? I guess 
else unless it's a scout. Are you up by a power? I'm on right underneath it. Okay, so those shots aren't at you? No, uh-uh. I'm going to try to figure out who they are, though. Yep. I'm going to go across the river via the tree. Okay. Green Dragon, thank you for the Prime, man. Where are you at? Right at the back of snipers, sniper scav up top. All right. Saw him. Yeah, I can hear him. I'm right at the back. I'm trying to figure out where anybody's oh, please at. Please don't look at me, scav. Okay, cool. He's at back corner here. He's a little blind. I'm going to come down to you now. Because these scavs have stopped shooting. Thinking that whatever player was here trying to fight them is probably dead or said fuck this, yeah. I'm running away. Because it's not like he was getting fucked up by an SKS scav and I I totally get it, man. Yeah, the sniper scav has an SKS. Oh, where'd he go? Have they done anything to do about the FPS drop yet? No, but it's also middle of the night for them, so. Can you see me? Uh, No. Oh, I saw your, <laughs> I saw your fucking tactical device again. Whoa, God damn it! Sniper scam shooting at me now. Run away. Where is he, dude? I don't know, but I saw the tracer. He shot and went fucking prone. Shooting you again? Yeah. Where's he at? He's gotta be on the left side all the oh, way back. Oh, prone somewhere. left side at the sandbag. Gotcha. I'll cross him. Yo, he's shooting at me through the damn... Get him? Like, I couldn't see his head, but he could shoot at me. I had him like... Twice in the leg or arm or whatever, and he finally stood up. No, don't mind me, back in my rat spot. I mean, unless the utilization thing is a huge, huge problem, like technical problem, hard for them to fix, I think it would be safe to say they'll have it fixed tomorrow sometime. But right now, it is currently. Ah, where's my mouse? 5 a.m. in Moscow. Alright, turns out I'm going that way. Where's that at? Uh, cottages. I'd be surprised if they're even at work in two hours. At. For two hours, so. Like, this is green. I was excited for it to come back, but this is weird. Disorientating. Just like the snow was disorientating when it first hit. Have I had a raid with no fog? Not yet. It says plates have a ricochet parameter in the 14 patch notes. That's not what it says on me. I can understand your interpretation of that, but that's not what it says.
that patch note is just poorly translated and it's talking about the fact that it doesn't say ricochet chance anywhere on here anymore. I'm on spine. So am I. I'm on the end of it. All right, well, as I'm moving towards Scab Island now. don't see anything I'll tell Omni I'll tell you right now bud um I know 100% that armor plates do not have ricochet chance there's not a doubt in my mind there's not it's not a, a guess I know that plates do not have a ricochet chance My theory right now is simply that a fragmentation is happening or something along those lines. And because of that, the bullet vanishes after it hits the plate. And it has to do something with the whole process of making it to where bullets cannot penetrate the chest anymore. Because we saw the same mechanic happening, but it had different outcomes prior to that. Can I elaborate as how you know this? No, I cannot, or I would. You're just gonna have to trust me, bro. You see, his dad works for BSG. Actually, his dad is Nikita, <laughs> and he told him. That's, that's what it is, yeah, yeah. Uh, you're not the trusting type. That's fine. I got something here at Cottages. Yeah, I'm kind of working my way that way a little bit. Is that you in the trees? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Behind you. By the power pole? Yep. Okay. Man, I almost went blapping. Soft armor is not below the plate. Wait, what? Yes, it is. It's just a scav here. Wait, what? <laughs> yes, it is. IRL and in with, well, with the exception of some very unique types of Russian armor, the quote unquote soft armor is behind the plate. The plate isn't sitting on top of the hard armor. You're right, it isn't just sitting there. It's held in a carrier with armor behind it. In fact, many of the armors that have soft armor in this game do not have armor at all. There is no air mid, but they add them to the game for game balance purposes. It's not a realism thing. Gavin here, but I don't know where the fuck he's at. Yeah, he's back in the cottage somewhere. Well, it's scary time because I can't see shit, and he can shoot me through bushes, and I only got class three on, and I don't want to get two tapped by a fucking SKS again. I mean, it's scary time. Oh, he's over at, by main cottage. I hear him walking. You hear me walking, probably. Are you moving right now? I was. He's over That's this me. way. Oh, I hear him now. Did he see you? Mm-hmm. Fuck did he go? God damn, dude. That's a bug then? What's a bug? You have you? just... Yeah, I think so. You have just... No, what you've... Ex 
Ow, he can see me through the... I'm dead again. He shot me through the fucking bushes, dude. I couldn't even see him. He was shooting me through the fucking bush, dude. An SKF scab, too. <laughs> fucking SKF scabs, dude. <sighs> the reason your aramid was damaged and your plate wasn't is because it didn't hit the plate. It hit the side of the plate and hit your armor and your soft armor. <sighs> 762 by 39 FMJ. He killed me with three shots and I only heard two. I think I only heard two. Maybe I heard three. It says I died to blunt damage though. Blunt damage is stupid. <laughs> okay. This is apparently very debatable. What is on me? He added uh, a reply to a message. Oh. Oh, at least I died by extract for you. <laughs> well, I'm not going into bushes. I mean, scavs are seen through bushes like yeah, like they used to back in the day. I thought they fixed that. Hmm. Well, no, I just think it hasn't been a problem because we haven't had any bushes. It's, we could see them. Oh, true. I think it's... So they actually still see the bushes. Did you grab, every, like, actually everything, or...? Except for your armor, yeah. Armor and helmet and backpack. I'm gonna have to buy a fucking other armor. <laughs> nope, we got our Ledexes. Ledexes? Or Ledex and Vertex, whatever. This has officially reached the not fun stage, Liston. <laughs> I knew this was coming. You knew this was coming. No, I honestly hadn't... It hadn't dawned on me that with foliage back... We were gonna have to deal with scav shooting through fucking bushes. I mean, I didn't expect that either. I was hoping it would be better. But... Just kidding. I just I don't remember them shooting through bushes before. Oh, we had what like thought, three? Had... We had like three days of. We weren't even off a of fucking. Uh, we were still running. Ground zero when it started snowing, dude. We had, we hadn't even checked any other maps yet. I just I remember like specifically saying like, oh cool, they're not seeing us through bushes. I mean they were they were shooting us through bushes last wipe. Yeah, last wipe, but I'm pretty sure it was this wipe we had done it, and like they weren't seeing us through bushes like that, but. You doubt you would get injured if the plate blocked the round. I understand the pain would get from a shot of a Kevlar vest. Huh. Depends on the round and the plate, Leviathan. 
Somebody shoots you with a 22 on a class four plus. Yeah, it's probably not even gonna hurt. Somebody shoots you, I don't care what fucking plate you have on, somebody shoots you with a 308. It's gonna, I mean, there's a good chance it cracks a rib. A really good chance. I mean, just the fucking force can kill you. On the converse of that, God damn it, I keep biting my lip. They've got, there's armor out there that'll stop 50 BMG. It'll stop it flat. Problem is there's still so much fucking energy that it still kills you. Cause the plate, you might not, the plate might not penetrate, but that's a hell of a lot of energy for your body to absorb. And that's what, that's what happens is it absorbs it. But none of that matters in this, honestly, in this discussion, who cares what fucking realism is? Armor has blunt damage because it's a balance issue. Because if you're shooting dog shit ammo at somebody and you mag dump them, it still provides you a chance to do enough damage to reset the fight or maybe kill them. Yeah, Oxide does some fantastic testing. Spaghetti? No, it is. Uh, it's taco. Um, it's like a taco stew or taco. I don't even know what it's called. It's like tacos, but made like kind of like lasagna. But it's not lasagna. It's fucking good is what it is. Like co crock pot tacos or something. Hang on. she can't hear me tortilla soup yeah that maybe that's what it is gerald tortilla soup Homemade, yeah. There's a scav out at the house already, thankfully. I 
think I hit him? There's no way I just killed him, is there? I may have. Right, how many more of these damn things do I need? Three more. Three more kills. Yo, he's... Do a video about what plays better on every level. Maybe now that they've actually got plates somewhat fixed and potentially working as intended, we can probably get some decent data now. It's just a matter of if I want to go through the effort or not. I can do a generalization right now um, with the data I have, but. Are you close to cottages? No. On its spine ish. The fog is bad. Yep. It is pretty brutal. something here with me yeah i'm trying to get up on spine where i can see but you can't actually see that far i think it's a scab or a player i think it's a player You're in the unlocked cottage, right? Yeah. Is he inside with you? Not yet. I heard bushes, but I haven't heard anything since. I'm trying to think, so he would have been by the fence in between the two cottages? Was last I heard him? I'm at the bus stop by construction right now. Sounds like fun. Scav just died. at the bus stop? No, I'm up above it on that ridge. Kind of towards bus depot. Yep, on that construction. Fucking fog just swallows everything, dude. I'm 
towards you. Yeah. Still just watching the back. I don't see anything back there. Alright. God damn, not that you could see fucking anything. Jesus. Fucking fog. With the zoom, I could see a little bit, but... Where is he at that he's shooting at me from? Where the fuck could he see me? Where is he? Was that SVT just in cottages right there? I believe so, yeah. I'm still watching it. I just got shot at from resort somewhere and I have no idea where, dude. Fuck these guys go. If they stayed in that little ditch right up underneath you and got off to the right, you probably wouldn't have ever even seen them, man. Hey, one more fucking scav. There he is. He's got a blueberry as well. He got the SVT because if he doesn't, yeah, make sure there's another one. He's running away, that's not ideal. Probably headed towards Scab Island, to be honest with you. He's got a blueberry on, he needs to kill scabs. But that first one was a headshot. Like you, you're hitting that one was. Oh, I was gonna say, looks like you're hitting just a little bit low. No, oh, you gotta ban somebody in chat because. Oh, good old YouTube. Peacekeeping is done. Okay, good. <sighs> Imagine letting somebody make that name. Way to go, YouTube. Oh, I'll this body really quick. I'm 
Mods fall asleep? No. Just don't have a lot of mods, man. Perfectly capable of uh, modding my own channel. A lot easier on Twitch, where they don't let names like that even get made. Oh, one of the most advanced fucking search algorithms in the world, if not the most advanced search algorithm in the world. And they can't stop shit like that. Damn, look where he fell. Uh-oh. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me right now? Um, well, we have a problem, Winston. I might have one too. <clears throat> oh, there it goes. Oh, not stuck. I need uh, oh, food win. and drink, by the way. Um, all right, well, I got some drink. I just hit a golden star to make it. Your right, my spine. I couldn't see anything before. I absolutely can't see. There's, I can see absolutely nothing now. Just so you know. Wow. I'm done with my task, by the way. Get the block off this map. Well, I got to see if piers open. not look like it's open. Nope, it is not. Wait a minute. No, never mind. It was just the tree. I heard some shooting down here earlier, so... Yeah, there was a fucking ketter. Oh yeah, one of my dailies is to kill five players with ketter. Got him. Where? He's running across the bridge right now. Down or up? Uh, to the other side. Up, like from from down there. Gotcha. No, he's not. He's right in front of me. Wait, what? Oh, I'm hurt. There's two of them pushing me. Yep. Um, I got you. I got the push. Don't peek if you don't need to. They're gonna shoot me underneath the fucking truck, dude. They're right on me. Nade over you. I don't have an angle on them, dude. Fuck. I'm going around the back. He's pushing right on me now, listen. There's one left. There's he's coming back now. They're right on the grass on the other side of me here. Yeah. Are you shooting at me? No. Down. The one's dead. Okay, we're good.
<laughs> How am I still alive? Because Liston drew his attention and let me get the swing on him and take, get the kill. I hope one of them has food. Okay, I got some food. Oh, poor guy had his marker still. The guy I killed was not a poor guy. He was a... There he is. Oh, I guess you killed the guy that I thought it. We have. Um... He doesn't have any food. Fuck. Oh, wait. Let me look in his bag. I'm... I had 8,000 things of FMJ. No food. He's got water, but no food. I got some sprats here. I'll throw in this guy's pockets. Thank you. Threw the armor out and took this guy's armor. Um, just marginally better. I'm not quite sure how they juked you out and you thought they were headed away because I came around the corner and he was, I don't know, 50 feet in front of me. <laughs> But I saw on your screen too. It did. I did look like they were headed this way. Yeah, I saw him. I saw him run up, and he went like. He must have went like behind this fucking truck, is what I saw. Like he came up, and he, and he came like over here, and then back. I guess I don't. I don't know. They definitely didn't expect you to fucking show up like that. No, that def, dude, that fucking, I've, I got into, I instantly deleted his ass. That dude must have known he fucked you up. Oh, yeah, I was coughing and because, fucking hacking he, and. He was all right with, like, leaving you and trying to peek me. Well, he was wow. fucked up. Well, the one you killed I was the one I first shot, and I probably put three or four 855A1 into him. Yeah. And I hide overboard. I think I might have bounced one off his helmet or something, but I, I think I was hide overboard hitting him in the chest and shit. And then, yeah, then he started hitting me, and I panic-fired, man. It just turned into us fucking hammering each other semi-auto and... What gun did that guy have? AKM? This guy had a very fancy AK-74M. With a waffle too, huh? Uh-huh. And the, I think it's the expensive B-30, the expensive Zenit parts too, which are the ones that I like. Like, I'll run this thing. Yeah, this is really close to how I build it, man. Really close. The difference is I don't put the waffle on it. <laughs> yeah, it's expensive. <laughs> Macaron, thank you for the prime. Appreciate it, dude. There's a scab somewhere here, y'all. Not heard him. Oh. I still gotta do 100 meters shots on him. I forgot about that. But... Another one. Mm. Oh, max strength. Oh. oh, you just walked right in front of me.
everything's different now than before the snow? I don't think so. I think this is what the maps look like. I guess it could be a little greener now. I don't think it's any more green. I think it's just more of a surprise that like all the green's back. Right, it's just a super stark like contrast. Just, yeah. Wait, is the waffle actually cheap now? It's not 140k? No. On the flea? I mean, it's not 140k on the flea, but it's still fucking... You're still close to... I think you're close... Even with vendor prices, I think you're still close to like 80k or 90k with the break and the suppressor. I'd have to look, but... Oh, interesting. I guess maybe now it's not as good because all guns recoil is not that bad. Well, especially the 545 AKs, right? Yeah, okay, so I see. But it's not it's not a massive difference between this and some of the other way cheaper suppressors that are like 30k yeah but the waffle looks cool it does it heats up like a motherfucker though well especially when you shoot heat up ammo you know well heat up ammo or not it tends to be more the 60 rounders that you put through it <laughs> well that's <laughs> well, that too right you throw a little BS in it and you're shooting, you know, 60 rounds of it. Uh, I think it's just going to turn red either way. Motherfucker. Let me vault with no energy. Fucking hell. Like, it doesn't take any. Why do I need it to do it? Yeah, that's kind of my question on it, too. Would the bagger get in back to three or upgrade to three? Is it back on the menu? Yeah. Um, yeah, the bagger yeah, is. It actually puts all those armors. It almost. doesn't. Uh, well, no, because most of a lot of them aren't. No, because like a lot of them don't have the chest coverage. Um, I think the only two were the M2 and the because CBC still sucks. The yeah, it doesn't have the side coverage either. Well, the CPC has sides. That's what's fucking weird. It doesn't yeah, cover thorax, I, I but it covers either. sides. Yeah. Well, you can put side plates in it, so it does kind of make CPC? sense. But yeah. I thought you couldn't put it in the CPC. I'm pretty sure you can. I'll look again, but I'm pretty sure the CPC has side plate ability. But it doesn't protect your... It only has the plate coverage on the front. Dude, I could let a fucking SA-58... I've been seeing it a lot, dude. The shorty SA-58 with a suppressor. I don't know, like, are people trying to be budget with it, or? Wait a minute, where is the armor? Or is it just a binar? Bino. The CPC. Oh, it's the craft, that's right. Yeah, I just look it up in the handbook is all I do. Yeah, it's got side plates. Either way, then, yeah, then the CPC is not gonna be that good anyway. But it doesn't, it, again, it only covers front plate, back plate. It doesn't cover thorax or upper back. What tact oh, yeah, tactics is the same. Yep. Tactics even worse. Yeah. <sighs> Baggerly is actually really good armor. Only thing it's missing is neck protection, but you can get by without that. The big thing is, though, like, class three neck protection is like. Eh. Uh, yeah, it's mostly for shotguns, dude. That's all it's gonna do. Yeah. It's gonna save you from shotgun rounds that are gonna one tap you otherwise. All right, I shouldn't have thrown that armor on the ground. Fuck. Why? I gotta buy another one now. Oh, you need it. I thought you were done. Got woods to do. 
Last one, but I got woods to do. All right, guess we hunt the sterminator. Yeah, I still need him, like, period. I haven't got him yet at all. A sketchy one. A sketchy one. Bagger lays um, up there with the fort now? No. No. It is a tier, but it is, what did I have it in as a D tier? I would say it's probably a B tier armor now. May, yeah, B tier is where I would, I would put it now. Uh, you could make an argument for A tier, I guess, uh, but yeah. Yeah, I'd have to say A tier with it being a class three now. But I mean, it's, it it's doesn't, basically the Osprey it without neck protection. It just doesn't cover the neck. Yeah, neck and arm. Which the arm protection isn't that much of a deal anymore, honestly, because <laughs> they can just shoot under the arm. Yeah, well the arms are the arms are the best armor in the game now. Oh. <laughs> It's actually better not to have armor there because then it doesn't fucking take out the armor. Well, it doesn't. It's not linked, so it doesn't matter. Those have their own hitbox, remember? They've got their own little armor area, so even if you take damage there, it's not like before where it it ruined the rest of the armor. You're, you're good. I right, can get rid of the paracord and Red Rebel. I'm still mad that they don't have a fucking Red Rebel extract on woods. Like what? Why? Where are they gonna put yeah, red rebel? Anywhere. Just give me the fucking red rebel extract back. Like Put it right where it was. Alright, twelve scavs on fucking woods. Ooh, proper reset. Man, I only need twelve oh, scavs over a hundred and I'm done with more shove in the world too. keep it reset by the way i don't know if you bought them recently no this is all the fucking thing isn't sold out i've been able to get one of these in forever dude yay it's the first osprey i've gotten in forever which we're going to have to hope that they get uh, a hot fix in here in the next day or so for the scav stuff. Um, it makes me wonder, wonder what they were dicking around with that they broke that again. I didn't see anything in the patch notes that was like, oh yeah, we're working on this and it's, it could have messed that up. Nah, it doesn't mean much. There's all sorts of things that can have an intertwined relationship that we don't realize but just curious to me what they did that they broke that again because they had just they just fixed it what two weeks ago what does mtx stand for my newest video microtransactions did i put it should be mxt shouldn't it is that MX, it's MXT? Did I fucking type it in wrong? Probably.
so I'm not pestily. Definitely not pestily. Way better accent than mine. God, those are expensive, dude. Those damn air filters are worth taking out a raid, man. What are they at? 280? Fucking almost, some of them weren't listed for 300. Like in the United States, we have like New York accents, Southern accents, Texas accents, you know, Midwestern, fucking Minnesota, like Minnesota, Wisconsin. They're basically Canadian accents. But does Australia have stuff like that? Do people like, are there really different accents between somebody who lives in, say, like in Mackay versus, or Mac, is it Mackay? It's Mackay, 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 or Sydney? Mississippi's not a different accent. That's a completely different fucking language. Devil, I have never heard anybody from Minnesota try to claim they have a normal accent ever. 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 And nobody from anywhere else on the planet is going to back you up. Cajun is definitely a different language. Yeah. It's not just Mississippi. It's fucking Louisiana, too. Ah, we tested armor earlier, Justin. Trying to get a couple of the tasks done, hopefully. I got to do this one, and then I still got to do decontamination. You're from Wisconsin, and people know it. <laughs> from Wisconsin, don't you know? Every state has their own language and accent. Um... God, when you lump in like Colorado, Wyoming, Montana, Idaho, and, and Nevada, um, there isn't really any accent there. The lack of accent is what sounds weird to people. Um, we say a couple of words funny for sure. Egg, flag, creek. Italian food. God, you want to know how bad it was moving to Philly and saying Italian? My first girlfriend, her family was super Italian. And I said that at their house and I thought I was going to get, I thought I was dead. I thought they were going to kill me. Super awesome family. Her mom was fucking, oh my God, what a good cook. They were gonna fucking turn me into a cannoli. <laughs> crick? Yeah, there's, that's another way to say it. I think crick and creek does change quite a bit around here, though. I, it's both ways. Pop. Yeah, pop's another where, one. Where in the actual I'm not sure. Landmines. Oh, no, no, here's the Scout House. Yeah. 
Oh, I uh, I thought we were on shoreline still. <laughs> A gavazool. Montana isn't a real state. Montana is one of the few places that still is real. You know what is state? You know what isn't real? A state that legalizes theft. Oh, no. No, 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 no. What? On the road. Shit, there's fucking a bunch more right there. No, not a, a smash and grab. Anything under what a thousand dollars? Seven fifty? Thousand something? Yeah, I don't know. It's changed. I think it's, it's changed. Anything under seven fifty or, or whatever the number is, um, is not a. Uh, there's a state one, and then municipalities misdemeanor. have misdemeanor. different ones as well, for sure. It was, it's prop something or other. I just saw the news that they were talking about how much yeah. of a fucking mistake it was. You don't fucking say. Do you use all those scabs? Oh, I got three of them. Well, I think I just saw a player looting in Alamo. He was looting the crate at the front, I think is what, what I saw. What the fuck is Alamo? Oh, sorry. It's been a long day. Shut the fuck up. No, I, I, what, what is Alamo? I don't understand what that is. Bob. Oh, okay. I was like, uh... I've got capturing outposts on the mines. Yo, this is... I don't even know if this is going to be possible, dude. I wouldn't even try and Oh, oh my god, as soon as I shoot, it turns jet fucking black, Liston. Well now I'm blaming you for not being able to see. Literally as soon as I go to shoot, it turns fucking jet black. I think I hit him, but I didn't kill him. There is like no, one no, blade of grass that is just fucking right in my way. Oh. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Going to 10. Oh, headshot. Look at that. Right as the sun sets. Right as the, the curtain pulls. Player? No, on sniper scav. Oh. That tracer out of my gun. But anybody watching would have saw my fucking tracer screeching across the sky, probably. Can't get into a scab right? Is there anything I can do? Not that I'm aware of right now, man. Uh, I think partying might help, but I'm not sure of that. I got someone here with me. Where's here? At 10. I'm a ways away, but I'm running. There's nade and smoke on me. 
Didn't even hear it. Or that one. You get him? Uh, no, I've got a couple on me. Where are you at? Uh, docks. Far. And scavs. I got one. I just, I just, SJ6. I have another one. Oh. I'm gonna head right for Duffel. Maybe that's a scav? That dude's mad as fuck that he just got blapped. I'm almost to Duffel. <laughs> he threw 80. Oh, there's another one. I'm almost to Duffel. Ooh, why does it feel like I'm gonna be just like five seconds late? Any idea where he's at? Nope. Yeah, he's behind 10. There might be two. I'm up on Duffel. He's at the back door. Yeah, he's got a flashlight. He's looking. There's two of them. He didn't see me? They think you're inside. Good. They got a flashlight on looking for you. Oh, he come around. One's dead. The other one's inside. Yep, I heard him. I'm gonna pack some mags really quick. I'm moving right a little bit, Liston. Pretty sure he's here in the corner on wood. Inside? Yeah. I think they were all three together. Yeah. He's at the door, I think. A the back door. door? Yeah, the little door. No, zero wasn't fucked up. I was zeroed at 200, which was the problem. He's going towards... Maybe. Yeah, he's running. Towards the far. He's running far. I don't see him. You think he ran back? Bad nade. I'm back on Buffalo Liston. Yeah. I'm gonna start my arm really quick. Yeah. You think he like ran away, ran away, or just? No, no, he's in there still. All right, well, I'm gonna loop around then. Yep. I am worried I'm just gonna run into another player though, so. I'll try to die somewhere. Is that a fucking player right there in those bushes? No. Nope. Sure fucking looked like it. Alright, I'm on the other side.
I see him. He's dead. <laughs> Is that your red laser in there? Yeah, yeah, I'm in here. Wait, did I just hear something else? Where was he? Oh, I see him. Alright. Oh, this guy was kind of low level, it looks. Ah, uh, level 24. Wait, that looks like white armor to me. Interesting. This dude thought he was thick Rick. Well, there's a key on the table in here. I've never found this key. Which key is this? East 308. Oh, this guy tried, like, pushing me hard throw with a fucking scoped in M700. What was on his fucking mind? I, I mean, they... You were fucked up. I kind of feel like there was a... That was a big part of the um, push. Yeah, someone had shot me. Uh, this guy hit me in the stomach a little. Or in the arm. Boy, when I when I was to hit the SJ6 to run over Wait, here... Man, what? You sure looked a lot worse than fucking just your stomach or arm fucked Level up. Level 16? Over there? Yep. Just killing any ice, Kev. Boys, where that scared me. Ooh. Fancy yog and a cheap rig. Oh, this man had was out here rocking an M1A, huh? Yeah, level six. He's got the test drive one at level 16. So either he killed someone for it or... Oh. No one will ever see me up here on this shelf, huh? Scab will. No, there's scab. Oh, up top there. Oh, there's two of them up there, dude. Where? Oh, I see them. Uh, above triples. The other one's further left. Oh my god, he's moving so unpredictably, dude. There's a fucking another one. Where is he? Listen, there's, there's like four down here still. We gotta get the fuck out of here. There's another one up on top still. Okay. It's just trying to get you your quest done fast. That's yeah. Cool. It's helping. And uh, extract you fast. Ah, that's wrong. I am uh, two more. Okie doke. Are those bad boys a spy in here? I think so. Spine or train station. Hmm. 
Well, there's one. I can hear somebody suppress shooting fast, listen. Semi-auto. No, I didn't. I did not hear that. I don't know what it was, um, but they're going to be right. They're they're right at the edge of being able to hear it. Uh, it might have been a fucking SMG, but I I, I think it was like an M4 or something. I'm not 100 percent sure. Huh. I wonder if they're moving away from us. I doubt it. Oh, it's an SKS. more no, than a, there's more than it's a, it sounds like an AKM I think there's more than one I think it was an SKS and an AKM dude I think both it could just be the AKM but I'm inclined to just sit tight and not run across the open field in front of them. Yeah, that's the one thing I don't like is that we're in the middle. I'm in the, literally in the middle of an open field in the one bush. He's running right up on me. You hit him. My grenade. I'm going right. There's another one right, Liston. I'm dead, dude. He fucking threw a grenade right at me. As he was running away. What? Dude, I shot his heart. Killed one. impacted me somehow he impacted you yeah I want to say we didn't even hear the impact on our screen, dude. It's fucking stupid, dude. I lit him up and somehow... 
I don't. trying to figure out if there's actually more than one or if it was just one there's no way that dude ran and was lit yeah up. i don't think so well when... i mean i guess maybe like like he had seen you and he was getting ready to Im try and impact on you but like man that's a hell of a fucking dumb play Nope, he's there. He's dead. We literally, I was looking up a chat and walked out and just happened to see him out of the corner of my eye. All right. Scavlooting you. <laughs> Fuck her already. Oh, well, that's fucking terrifying, Liston. Mm. Another player just walked up on me. Yep, but I don't know if he's alone. I got your rig and your backpack for now. Scav had your gun that I killed. And I got your bag and rig out in case this, another one shows up here. He's got a buddy. Never mind, it was an AI scav. I think this guy over the third guy that rolled in was just some random fucking third party he had no idea what he was walking into
Oh my god, Liston. Um Mr. Man is a bit of a weirdo. I don't know what the fuck he's got on his MP5. <laughs> Where did he go? But I'm going to let him have it back just for creativity purpose reasons. <laughs> Were you just running M80? Yeah. Did you not throw my gun yet? Uh, I'm gonna go. It's on the body of the scab that I killed. I'm gonna grab it, um, and maybe bring it out for you. What are you getting rid of? You're not gonna have room for an SR25. Um. Um. I won't. I mean, I guess if you take the shitty backpack, but... Well, I have... Backpack's still sitting right here, it is. Do you want me to? Do you want me to bring your SR25 out or not? I'll I mean, make room for it. Out, yeah, yeah, I'll have room for it. Make sure the scab didn't grab any more of your stuff. Because I'm not, I'm honestly not that worried about the uh, M1A. I 
I see you're probably better off parting out the AUG as well. Probably more stuff. Like, the AUG itself is cheap. Just take the parts out of it. Because the AUG, the gun is 450k. Yeah. For all those slots. Go grab your... Check your rig and make sure there's nothing worthwhile in there. Think about the microtransactions. Just did a video on it, Tom. Comp six. Fleet prices are up because scavs can't get into streets. Um. Yeah, and uh, flea market always does weird shit when they reset, when they take servers offline for a few hours for patches. Just did a video, Tom Six, talking about all that stuff. And lucky for you, all my discussion about the microtransactions are pretty much at the front of the video. The green almost looks wrong. Yeah, it's definitely confusing. Yeah, everything's green. that I got to make a video on something that wasn't going to happen. Ow. Dude. Oh, a fucking AI scav that I can't see. Like another one just fucking shot at me too, but I'm also worried that that was a scav shooting at another player or somebody coming this direction to extract as well.
Holy shit. Six thirty six fifty seven on that scav. Headshot, sniper. All right, well, we don't have to go back to woods. <clears throat> I think all that I have left now is decontamination for fucking... Um... Um... Lightkeeper? Okay, so I got your SR-25. I got three of your mags. All right, where, uh, where are we going? Uh, it don't matter to me. I just got to kill all the bosses still, so... Yeah, me too. The only boss I actually have killed is Kaban and fucking Rashala. I don't have a room for this. Son of a bitch. Alright, well, I guess we're running this because I don't have a room for it. Lots of dog tags. Um, interchange then or what? That's fine. Close to being done with uh, decontamination? Mm, if I we have a good rate, I think I can get it done, but no. I'll look here in a sec. Uh, 17 more. Oh, sorry, 27 more? <laughs> Never mind. I thought it was 17 more, but it's 27 more. So, quite the view.
Thanks, Michael. We're gonna get decontamination done tonight? I don't know. I think this might be my last raid. We'll see. Let's hope I can kill Killa. I'm so fucking tired of not seeing any fucking bosses in any raids, dude. Feels like we're on fucking woods again, dude. So green and lush. I really, really don't like this spawn. No, this is like one of the worst spawns for sure. This is a spawn that I've killed. I don't know how many players from the fucking... Well, I guess you can't see anymore up there. Glad I got that done and over with. When I did. What's that? Oh, the kills I got on... Um, interchange from that tower up there. Nobody checked. Quite literally, every time I spawn under it, I would run up there and I would kill at least one or two players running in from it because you could actually see really, you had really good sight lines because there was no fucking bushes or anything. I am going to dislike playing maps like Shoreline and Woods again even more because you sit in bushes. I, mean, I guess I custom to play well. those anyways, but yeah, I mean, it's, it's going to make sitting in bushes a lot easier again, but... People were gonna the rat. Side, they won't be sitting in the corners. They'll just, be sitting in bushes. Just say, was gonna, they're gonna rat. They're gonna rat anyways. It doesn't really matter. I'm going in the front of the mall. Two players listening right in front of you. In front of me. Three players right in front of you, listen. Where's right in front of me? But you're going, oh, sorry, to your left. The, the the opening to your left, they're right underneath you. Sorry, I thought when you said front of the mall, I was assuming you meant the front opening. Um, they, uh, it's a three man. They, they, uh, they're right underneath the front of the mall, essentially. That one. 
I got a fucking another solo player looking at me right now. One down. I'm I'm not anywhere near. Listen, I ran away. Because uh, I got another single player over here at the tents underneath. Idea fucking shooting at me now. Where did they go? Um, one went towards the hole. I only saw two. Hundred. There was three. I saw three. No question. It's not like a question. There was three for sure. Right. Where are you at right now? I'm like outside right at the front of the hole. Okay. I'm right to your left at the base of the escalators. Uh, I saw one run back, but I didn't see the third. I don't want to move forward because I don't know where the third one's at, man. No, that's a terrible idea. In fact, I'd say almost just give them up now and go upstairs inside. Up to you, though. I'm tempted to go all the way around and come from underneath Ollie. I think you're going to run into another player if you do that. That's the problem. Um. You said you killed one, right? Yeah. And I saw run one run back to the hole towards the hole. Okay. Hope I see one in the tent. Waiting for him to give me a shot. I don't know if he will. He's like in sliding, big, no, far tent, but he's like trying to get a position on you, so be careful. Like he's like snaking around trying to get like a precise angle, it looked like. You're talking about the tent that's right in front of me, right? All the way in the back from where you're at, way back on the left. Yeah, this one. No. Behind, it's probably behind that orange connex, to be honest with you. I can't tell exactly, listen. It's, but it's, it's, it's far enough back that it's almost on the back wall. So I don't think it's the one you're looking at. But I'm not 100% sure. I didn't know there was another one there. But I mean, there's like three tents here. Oh, did I just see one far? He's not in that tent. I'm, I'm positive of that. I don't remember if the entrance is on the back, front or back of that tent, though, was one problem.
just heard one. Fuck. So there, he's like behind the forklift for you, dude, like past back, like maybe another 60 meters past the forklift, which is I'm worried about the angle you're holding that he's going to see you. I don't want to move up too much. I'm, I like moving anywhere is going to be kind of dangerous for me. Are you like on a pillar or something? Away. Yeah. But I'm outside, which is also dangerous. He's running. I don't see him. Oh, Towards hole. He was to my left. He just ran and jumped? Yeah. I think he's behind the yellow tent. He's running again. Is he dead? One's dead. Okay. He was the on that corner. Far. Yeah, he's dead. Where's the other guy? The, uh, the other guy was the one that went towards hole. Yeah, you were telling me to my right. He was way far left. Running at me? Might be an AI scab, dude. That was. I'm trying to move up as slowly as I can. You're good. He's to my right. He's over by hole somewhere. He had no idea you were still there. He just saw me there. You good? He's pushing me. I'm, he just shot me through the tent, dude. What? I'm dead. <laughs> what?
Oh, I just saw him. Was there four? No, it's just the same one. He was... He doesn't know he killed me. He they wall banged me through that far green tent. Was the, on the left. My, yeah, you should see my body. I saw, I saw him for a second. Oh, yeah. He, I don't even, even think he knows he killed me. Was he just he shooting my not. body? Yeah. He knows you're around somewhere because we both killed one. Yeah. There he is right there. God damn it, dude. I'd move, man. Just get out of bail out of there. Cause he's gonna peek you when you're looking at that fucking scav. Yes, yes. It looked desync than a wall bang? No. He sh was shooting me through the tent spray and he didn't even know he had killed me. He did exactly what I would have done. Spray through the tent to try to get a shot. A lucky hit. And that's what he did. On, show me your. I'm just gonna let Liston play this, um, and not try to backseat him on this one. But what I think's gonna happen, the problem is, is Liston's sitting still right now, and this guy is gonna slow peek over here. He's back there somewhere. Oh, did you saw him go back to the right. Yeah. I swear he's going to slow peek you on a corner and bop you. Could I play faster if I wanted to? It sounded like he's got an ump, so I'm just trying to make sure he doesn't get to your body. And grab your gun. That's the only thing I'm worried about. Kill me with 855. Really? Oh. Then he's got an MDR of some sort. Because it was slower. Could be a scar or two. Oh, I didn't think about scar, yeah. Fucking head ears me. God damn it. What do you mean, could I play faster if I wanted to? I play faster when I want to. I play slow when I want to. Oh, yeah, there's a scar. He got so lucky with that shot. He just random sprayed through the tent and caught me with fucking head ears, dude. <laughs> I might have actually survived if I'd had a U lock on instead of an AACCH. He killed you with what ammo? 855A1? Yeah, but he hit me with 856 too, so he's got stacked mags.
See you. Fuck. I'll chat. I think that's where we're going to call it. Late night. I'm tired. And I still have to make another video real quick before I go to bed. I was up late last night because of the patch notes. Don't want to do that again tonight. Wait. Maybe decontamination isn't needed for network provider? I just wonder it was. Why do you have it? It just pinged. Oh, no. It gave me a check. Oh, another task has yeah. been completed for it. Yeah. We appreciate you guys hanging out tonight. Thanks for all the help with those that helped with the testing earlier. We'll do a video summarizing that. I don't know if I'll get it done. I'm not going to get that done tonight. I need to get through my thoughts. I need to put together some B-roll, stuff like that. So, um, You all have a wonderful Monday evening. Um, I actually might have to take the stream off tomorrow because I got the wife has something for work, so I have to go get the kids from school. So unless I get started early, we'll have to not do a stream tomorrow. So we'll have to wait and see. But we'll keep you guys posted. You all have a good rest of your evening. And... Uh, See you guys on the next go around, all right? Good night, everybody. <laughs>